Yo, what's up? I'm super on time. Whoa, I just got logged out of Twitch. Am I live? Am I, did I get hacked? <laughs> okay. Um, I don't actually think I got hacked, but, um, Mm -hmm. Maybe it'll fix my, uh, I can't, even, I can't even log in. Twitch is so great. Um, but hi, what's up? Good morning. Um, I was sort of on time and then I couldn't figure out how to change my title and then figured I should go get some tea and stuff afterwards. Um, I'm not gonna, I got two factor off into Twitch quick here. Um, got some gauntlet stuff to go over with you guys. Some, some exciting news. And, um, and then I, I want to work on maybe, set, maybe the B movie challenge again today. I think I can do it. Um, so we'll see, <laughs> we'll see how it goes. <laughs> um, but welcome, hello. Uh, I hope you're. I hope you're well. Did you get any trick or treaters last night? Honestly, I don't know. I was. I was. If I did, they didn't get anything. I was. I was streaming, and then um, after the stream, I had a bunch of meetings. Uh, my wife and mother in law are with the with the kid bogas. Um, I kind of live in the. Uh, I'm inadvertently doxing myself. I live. I kind of live out in the middle of nowhere though, with with like chickens and stuff. So uh, like, if if someone did, usually we have a couple um, candy bars. Like 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 we have a box of. Um, my wife bought like. I don't know, like a. A pretty a pretty big, box of candy bars, and we're like, if someone shows up. Like they could have, we'll just give them the box because like no one's ever gonna come to our house. So <laughs> anyway, but yes, if somebody did, if somebody did show up, they could just have they would have the score. But anyway, um, did you send trick or treat to the Bitcoin site? No, no. Um, but yeah, good to see you guys. I'll, I guess I'll, uh, let me play. Oh, here's the music we can play today. Actually, actually. Um, check this out. I don't think this has been updated since yesterday, which is fine, but... So if you weren't here for the, it was a very short stream yesterday, but, um, and thanks, uh, to the team for, <laughs> for working on that already and missed through that to that little remix together quick. Um, we, we added a quick update to the gauntlet. Well, I say quick, but, um, an update to the gauntlet where instead of just saying things like purple pig, which is still funny, um, they can also say, um, various lyrics to songs. Uh, so, for example, if you watch the video or you've been keeping up with the streams, scammers on hold. Every so often, it says to make sure you're still there. Please say "Purple Pig." Well, now it'll say, "Please say, hey, now you're an all-star or whatever." And and so we're eventually going to be able to build out <laughs> more of these songs. Um, potentially. Uh, so someone else had an idea that suggested potentially we build, um, 
Simon says with humming. Um, so we'll say to make sure you're this isn't an automated call and you're a human or whatever, please repeat the pattern and it'll be like hmm 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 or whatever and then get there but well it'll actually be patterns of um of the songs so then eventually we can get <laughs> we can get them humming the song and then we'll layer their hums and their and their speaking and then the super ultimate dream is to have a scammer who's been on hold for five days listen to the to the whole music that is the music they made and see if they notice <laughs> but anyway um <sighs> make them do beatboxing oh like please please do a drum solo like and then get them to <laughs> is a part of our new ai captcha system <laughs> To make sure you're, to make sure you're human, please. <laughs> yeah, like have them do different. Please make the sound of a hi hat, like this. Please make the sound of a. <laughs> if you're still here, drop the bass. Yeah, that would be. <laughs> That would be interesting. Um, I forgot time change. Wait, was there a time change? Wait, what? Oh yeah, wait, I think like someone told Miss told me about that. In Europe, yes. Yo, happy. Time change. What day is it for you guys? Is it like <laughs> I'm kidding? Sunday? Do we have more or less time in Europe? You're 20 minutes early. Yes. Oh man. Can we just keep it that way? Like some of my, some of my, uh, cl the, some of the cl my closest fans and and great friends uh, have have been from from yo i gotta say to the folks out of the u.s you guys are built different in a good way <laughs> can i just say <laughs> i feel like every <laughs> there's been some great people in the u.s too don't get me wrong Pe people on the you know people volunteering around the team who are in the u.s like you're great too i'm just saying a lot of people that i've met outside of the u.s have been just great <laughs> so I'm just saying, you gotta step it up, America. <laughs> um. All right. Well, is that sarcastic? No, I'm. I'm. I'm just saying that. Uh, yeah. It's even like. I shouldn't. I can't give too many of these examples publicly, but uh, so I'll just stop talking. But. Is the Shrek movie script too difficult? I don't know. I don't know the Shrek movie. I think B movie is a good challenge. Um, I got a little bit of the way through it the other day. Um, and I'm gonna be honest with you. Like maybe, maybe, maybe I should pick another script. But it sort of was a joke, and and then I started doing it. And just to be completely tr like, I genuinely enjoyed myself doing it. I don't know why, and maybe I won't enjoy it today. I tend to be, um, I'm pretty like new new challenges and new experiences and new problems to solve. Really, you know, get me going. So per perhaps it's just because it was something I've never done before. Like that could be, that yeah, it could just be like ADHD. I I don't know what it is, but. Um, I don't think that's just like an ADHD thing. I think it's just whatever. Um, but yeah, I kind of, so we got, let's say like 10, 15% of the way through the movie. And I'm like, I'm pretty sure I could do this. I think I could. And so I kind of just want to try it. So we'll probably do that a bit today. Um, just cause I'm curious. <laughs>
<laughs> and then um we'll see. So a couple other things. There was a just to, to just to catch you up. I don't have any alerts on, I just realized. Thank you guys. Um thank you guys for all of your support thus far. Um Cat, I just saw your message. That was good. <laughs> What's up? Sometimes, sometimes chat like, ooh. Oh, okay. Um, when you realize, when will you release a long video version of the scammer maze? I don't know. I I was thinking about that. So maybe there will be a more Kipoka video that's just like super cuts of. Tons and tons of phone calls, but, uh, but yeah, the, it's just lots of audio, not video. So tri it's tricky, but let me, let me get some of the alerts up so I can see some, uh, things, but thank you guys for continuing to support the the streams and thank you to those of you who watch the youtube videos or um a, f a, a friend um post a friend posted the video on reddit with with uh, and and it was like the gauntlet video i think it was like on r slash videos for a while yesterday you guys are great so thank you for uh just doing that stuff um it means a lot so yeah um a box full of puppies. Thanks. Crisp lettuce. Nice. Um, so one of the features that was in that video, it's a pretty new feature. Some of you must know about it in the gauntlet. Um, is, uh, are the, are the drawing. Oh my gosh. We're into melodies. We're into melodies. <laughs> it was supposed to be. This is from Toto, Africa, Toto, or ancient melodies. We're into melodies. We're into melodies. We're into melodies. <laughs> Why did you say it so many? Don't tell me you are too blind to see. <laughs> Don't tell me you are too blind to see. I don't go out of blind. Don't tell me you are too blind. <laughs> why, why is he is he laughing because he knows how insane this is? Never gonna let you down. Never gonna let you down. Never gonna let you down. Who let you down? <laughs> why are you saying it so many times? <laughs> but the media men beg the difference. <laughs> Okay, well that's not what I was gonna show you, but anyway, it looks like we've got some we've got some scammers, uh Your heart been aching, but you are too shy to say it. <laughs> ah! oh, we gotta get more scammers in the gauntlet. I can't even there uh, forget the B movie script, bro. This we just need to get more scammers saying song lyrics. <laughs> it's just so stupid. But I love it. Um Someone, what was it? There was a Reddit comment where someone said that it was, that they felt something like that I was psychotic and that I shouldn't have trapped the scammers in there because they don't deserve it. And I was like, bro, call me psychotic. <laughs> I don't care. It was great. I love it. And I'm going to keep doing it. <laughs> so gotta, that's fine. You can label me whatever you want, dude. Because... <laughs> I genuinely enjoy watching them. Uh, <laughs> you, you call me a madman all you want, but um, maybe they maybe they shouldn't try to steal someone's uh, money. I don't know. I mean, they don't have to be in there. They can leave. They can leave whatever they want. They just don't steal the Bitcoin, right? All all you do is not go back on the website. Right, I didn't lock them in my basement chained to a wall. Okay, that would be too far. They voluntarily entered into the trap. And they can choose to stop playing whenever they want. 
anyway, um, I want more dialogue speeches from Princess Bride, the Palpatines. Oh my gosh, we really could. We really. I didn't even think about that. That's such a good. Thank you, Brian K sixty four. I'm gonna put that. In. I didn't even think like I didn't even think about that. The the we could have them say like I am the Senate. Senate. We we could have them do the 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 dark Plagueis the wise thing. We could have like every meme. We can have an entirely entire catalog of just memes and all kinds of stuff. Like we could have them say, <laughs> "Are you familiar with the tragedy of Darth Darth Plagueis the wise?" The Jabberwocky poem is perfect. Perfect. Twas Brillig and the slithy toves did gyre and gimble on the wave. At, well, how would the AI say that? Um. Oh, you guys are so fun. Um. Let me see if I can. I'm not sure how the AI would even say it. Some of Michael's talking heads from the office. <laughs> this would all be great. Um, twas brillig in the slivy. I don't even know. Like, isn't like half the point of that poem that it's just nonsense words that don't actually like? I'm not sure how that how that text to speech. Twas brillig and the slivy toves did gyre and gimble in the wabe. Yeah, it's not bad. Twas brillig and the slivy toves did gyre and gimble in the wabe. Twas brillig and the slivy toves did gyre and gimble in the wabe. Slivy, is that what, is that what I always said? Something else, slivy, I think. Okay. <laughs> Hadst thou slain the Jabberwock? Come into my arms, my beamish boy. So that's not what I was going to show you. What I was going to show you. My wolf's on fire. How about yours? My wolf's on fire. How about yours? Why? Um, thank you for repeating it. Judging by the whole in satellite picture. Judging by the whole in satellite picture. Judge thank you for Thank you for giving us. Never going to tell a lie about you. Never gonna tell a lie about you. You bottled up now. Wait till you get over. You bottled up now. Wait till you get over. A full commitment when I'm thinking of. A full commitment when I'm thinking of. <laughs> the worm is getting warm, so you might as so warm. <laughs> it's so, the water is getting warm, so you might as well swim, bro. The worm is getting warm, so you might as so warm. <laughs> the worm is getting warm. It's good. <laughs> Shut up the road and I hit the ground. Hey, <laughs> why did he say hey at the end? Does he know it's a song? Do you, no, he can't. Why would he still be on hold? He's, he was on hold for like an hour. She took the rude and I hit the ground. Hey! She took the rude and I hit the... Hey! Maybe he thought that that's what he was supposed to say? You wouldn't get this from any other guy. You... <laughs> <laughs> He's so... I wonder if we should... Okay, for some of these scammers that have been on for days... Again, not the not the like new scammers who potentially victims would come in. The ones who like are just they're just trapped in here and not having getting anyone to help. If we I wonder if we if we had it say like like a fifty fifty shot to be like Okay, sorry, this time with a little more rhythm or like try again with a little bit more passion behind your voice or, or whatever. I, I wonder if that's too much. Sorry, that was a little too quiet. This time with a little bit more pep. Camera lag? I don't know. Sorry. Um, what I was going to show you is
as a quiet conversation. Something else. Uh, there was a scammer. I believe one of the scammers that we talked to yesterday, but I'm not 100% sure on that because I didn't take very good notes. That spent, I think, something like two hours drawing yesterday. And uh, they are by far the most detailed drawings that I've <laughs> that I've seen on this thing. Like they went nuts with this. So let me show you a couple of them before we move on. Um, I'll just put this here. Oh, I I can't. Can you copy paste into? Oh, that's kind of a shame. Um, one second. Let's look a f try to think of a fast way to do this for you. Hmm. Can you put them in a stable diffusion? What? And like, that would be, that'd be kind of interesting. Like make them better basically, but these are pretty good. Like I'm, I'm just, I'll just save a couple of them. I'm kind of afraid to share my screen because what if I leak something that I shouldn't? But and by leak something, I mean like the the the, the wrong URL to the gauntlet. But I mean, it's insane how much time they. They they like really it's like they decided, you know what? I am gonna pass this test. I've although I've been drawing for day for days, today is it. They sat down and chose like to pass this test. Um okay, so here's a f there's so many drawings. Um like okay, I'll just show you I'll just show you one. So for example, they they have to draw a oh my god, it, they're endless. They're endless, bro. I had to just share my screen. There's too many of these. Um so like they had to draw a shoe. Okay? And you've seen some of the shoes that scammers have drawn. Right? Look at this. Look at that shoe. Look at the uh, look at the detail, and then and then and that didn't pass, right? They didn't. That wasn't good enough. So then they drew like like a, a I don't know, like a clat, a little bit more up, up fa a little fancier shoe. That's insane. Those are good shoes, <laughs> and then and then the snake wearing a hat. Like they even drew the pink hat and the red. And then, and then when that didn't like, like they really went all out with these. That 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 last one, <laughs> they spent hours drawing these, like meticulously with this really bad drawing thing going through. And then for castle, look at these castles. <laughs> like the detail. They put so much effort into this. It's, it's I don't even know what to say other than it's insane. Uh, here's a crow lifting weights. Probably one of the better crow lifting weights pictures I've seen. Um, we really need to we really need to look at the code for this. Maybe even today. I, I mean, I wrote it poorly, uh, so it's my fault. But. I think we need to add some other um, challenges. Like we got to get some more pictures in here. If this guy's just going to keep drawing, we don't want him to draw the same thing over and over. There needs to be more. Uh, okay. Anyway, Gauntlet Arts, the new Dolly. We're just going to train. We'll just train an AI model off of sc scammer arts, a scammer artwork. There's a banana. Look at these bananas. 
It's like a here's a robot billboard saying got milk. This banana uh, that no, that's not I don't know what that is. That's uncomfortable. That's a weird picture. <laughs> I don't like I don't like that one. <laughs> <laughs> that's actually a, yeah that would be like multiple banana I guess we could say multiple bananas um <laughs> oh man so anyway that's um tales from the gauntlet I feel like we need to have a series now <laughs> Just random updates from ridiculous things the scammers do in the gauntlet. Um, let's see if there's any other ones. We're no stranger to the. I can't get over it. like the shoes are are just incredible. We haven't fixed it on mobile yet. Someone's just been trying to complete it on mobile for like, <laughs> for like days. <laughs> but that's okay. They must be surprised of how, yeah, cause look at the, so if I find the sh shoe, let me give you an example of like another dude's shoe. So if I go back to, where, where was it? So there's, so another dude who claims to be uh, like a pretty high up Illuminati leader who is now in the gauntlet, you know, like you have to pay money to join the Illuminati scam. Look at his shoe. What is that? It's like a, a scribble, maybe a really bad rocking horse. I don't a hat. Yeah, there's definitely that's definitely not a shoe. I mean, maybe just not a great drawer, but <laughs> I'm just saying, like, the, the class of the bar is pretty low for, for what other scammers have drawn. Here's one. Uh, oh, hold on. Here's one other shoe. This is just like a sock. I would say this is more of a sock, but like. But that's what I was expecting a scammer to draw. <laughs> These are insane. Oh, man. So someone else suggested last time, which I think we'll end up implementing at some point. Just want to see how much time it takes. Is when a scammer draws a shoe... Then we have another scammer who's on hold. We present them that picture. So we we could use an AI model to validate stuff, right? But what if, what if instead it ends up being, the, if there's other scammers on, it says, if there's a little loading bar while it says like validating. And another scammer on hold has to look at the picture in their dashboard. And it's like, is this a shoe? And then if they're like, no. Then, <laughs> then the scammer has to keep <laughs> So it's not an AI model, it's just the scammers are validating the other. <laughs> oh. oh my gosh. I'm cr I think I'm crying. Anyway. <sighs> So, yeah, I hope you guys are well today. We don't need, we don't need, listen, we don't need AI when we've got a bunch of scammers trapped doing our. <laughs> now I'm just thinking of what was that thing? What was that Amazon thing? Does it still exist? I don't really know the ethical implications of this. What was that Amazon thing where you, you could like get people to do work for like a penny? It was insane. Um, I don't remember. Mechanical Turk. Yeah, I really don't know much about it other than wasn't it their take on like 
there's certain things that humans have to validate. Yeah. It, now all I can think about, <laughs> all I can think about is this is probably ethically unsound. Uh, I'm not sure this is actually something I would ever do, but just the first thing that popped in my head was like kids like submitting their homework and crap and having the scammers like, or, or mechanical Turk, like, Oh, you need someone to, you need someone to go through your CSV file and, and label the data. <laughs> Sure, upload it to the gauntlet and we'll have our we'll have our unpaid beta testers take care of that right away. Um <laughs> forget AI taking our jobs. It's the <laughs> Again, ethically, this is probably something we shouldn't do. I think it's funny, but but yeah, that's probably too far. Um <laughs> That that probably deserves some uh some thinking. <laughs> Unless, <laughs> oh, jeez, they gotta earn their. Well, that's the that's what it turns into. No, 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 no. So then, so what we do is we put them to work. So imagine that dude yesterday. I kind of made fun of him. I feel like I almost start to feel bad. The dude spent, I don't remember how many hours it was for a hundred and fifty dollars, and you start to add it up, and you're like, bro. It's like a dollar an hour. Like, what are you, what's going on, man? Um, you're trying to steal $150 and you've spent like days. Uh, and so what you, what, what if we, if we did put them to work again, I don't know if I'd ever actually do this and the ethical implications might be, in, you know, I'm just, I'm just thinking out loud here. Please, please. We put them to work and we have them do this validation stuff or whatever it is. And then at the end, we're like, Hey man, thanks for, <laughs> then we actually do give them, we actually do give them some money, not for the, not for what they stole, but for the other. We're like, nah, I don't like that. I don't want to, I, uh, I changed my mind. I take it all back. Forget I ever said anything. See, this is what it's like if you had a real job, you get paid for real work. Okay. Um, yeah, 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 yeah. Have them take an IQ test. <laughs> Your honor, it was in Minecraft. Yes, an IQ test could be funny. It's like, in order to continue your withdrawal, we have to make sure you're smarter than a fifth grader. We have to make sure that you're, to, you have to, to use our system, you need to be 18 years or older, and you have to pass a general aptitude test <laughs> or something. <laughs> like, you have to be able to pass the following uh, quiz to make sure that you're legally smart enough. <laughs> They'd probably just cheat. I mean, I would cheat too. Like, I, I would make it so they can't pass the test. <laughs> you think it's going to be fair? Okay. Well. Now that I'm laughing about all this stuff. <sighs> hey, now. Mm -hmm. Do -do -do -do. Get them to recite the alphabet backwards without making a mistake. Hmm. Uh, honestly, one of the big things we're trying to work on too is the. I think I showed you guys the graph once before. Uh, let me pull it up again. We're working on, you guys hate when I say play testing, but I'm just going to say it anyway. We're working on one sec. Working on this.
This is, this is our hardcore strategy. <laughs> Wait, you can't see it. Fit to screen. You gotta. This is our. <laughs> you gotta f figure out how to get the uh, to bridge the gap there, so that the the people, <laughs> the people that only spend like, you know, the hour to two hours. We gotta convert. <laughs> we gotta convert them. <laughs> Into the, into the. <laughs> but seriously, though, uh, that is, <laughs> that is what we're working on, is thinking about how to, how to get the average scammer to spend, uh, more, more time. So. Uh, gamify it? Yeah, we've been, we've been thinking about, um, like we we part of it just what do you what do you say? It's funny because it's I, I talked about it in the video a little bit, but it started off as like a funny joke, and then it started working and it was funny, and then we kept doing more, and then like oh victims are getting in there, and like it just became this like oh my god, um, it, it this is this is insane, um, and so it's sort of just been we've been letting it cook a little bit for a while. Uh, we've also been working really hard on some other projects so um but yeah we ha we had some ideas about just even like silly things it sounds funny but i think it could help the psychology of it where they like they get daily we were just joking about like yes the illusion of progression like daily login bonuses or a little a little chart that shows their progression of like completing their security onboarding that like as long as that bar is going up every so often, then and they think that they're and they think that they're they're actually progressing. Um, potent yeah, a gauntlet MMO. <laughs> yeah, but we were thinking about those things because it's silly, but it does kind of work. Uh, like in in games or whatever, where you're like, oh, okay, uh, I made a little progress today. Great. Um. So, we'll see. Compensate them for the time on hold. Yeah, that there you go. We know your time is valuable. Sorry you spent so long on hold. We've added point zero zero three four Bitcoin to your. That, that, <laughs> what if we did give them like a five dollar? What if we're like? We're sorry you were on hold for so long. We've added five dollars to your balance, and then they're gonna be like, "Oh my god, I'm gonna stay on hold forever, bro." I can make money. <laughs> I can make money just staying on hold. <laughs> that 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 actually um reminds me of we another idea that we had, which I did once years ago, and this was related to the gauntlet. We just prioritized the gauntlet. Was um remember the fake gift card survey we did on stream where the scammers. Like on when I filled out the the survey, we still might do this someday. So I should stop talking about this. Yeah, whatever, it doesn't matter. I already said it. So the the thought was like, oh, we basically make the gauntlet, but for fake gift cards. So they think if they fill out a ridiculous survey, they get the gift card at the end, right? Well, potentially we could we could do something similar, just wrapped into this gauntlet, or like <laughs> while you're on hold, would you like the opportunity to get a five dollar Wendy's gift card or or whatever and then we have them do like some ridiculous task and then it's like congratulations uh even though they never actually would get anything but <sighs> make them watch ads monetize them and then give the money so that's 200 IQ unfortunately i don't think um you know, they'd have to watch a lot of ads. Uh, and if the companies that were running ads <laughs> realized that we were we were playing ads to scammers, they wouldn't like that. So, um, yeah, interesting idea. Uh, I, I like where you're going rogue, likely. But, unf yeah, unfortunately, I don't think that one's going to... I don't think that, that one's going to work. Um create fake ads that was on our list i think i showed you some 
Maybe we'll do that later. The idea was to let you guys help auto generate like AI ads. Um, we'll probably play with this stuff later. It just comes down to like, this is, this is, I'm just being honest. This is what sort of happened that has been happening with um, like the stream is where like, I love these ideas. I think these are so fun, but they take time. Um, so like, could we sit around and mess with, getting it so you guys could could help uh influence an ai to generate ads that the scammers listen to while they're on hold yeah but now we take that that's going to take a few days of 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 streaming and coding and and like working on it and well that's not usually what i do uh, on stream and so there's this weird like how do you juggle all of that because um the ideas are so fun, but they've they've become much more involved. Um, anyway, so today, just don't sleep. <laughs> Hire an intern. <laughs> okay, you guys are you guys have got great. You guys got great suggestions. <laughs> um. Today, we'll do some others. Yo, Gorby, thank you for the kind words and tier three for 50 months. Thank you. Um, just to incorporate this into the gaunt. Oh, that, there you go. Have the scammers program for me. Um, what was I going to do today? Am I going to do the B-movie today? Now I'm just thinking about the gauntlet, but whatever. Now I just want to get more scammers singing songs in the gauntlet, but we'll see. <laughs> um, <laughs> hire me as an intern to sleep for you. Oh, <laughs> so then, so then, <laughs> So then I don't have to sleep. You can just sleep for me. <laughs> oh, man. That's five head. Have you done machine learning with Python? Yeah, so I once I just I once made a AI model from scratch to validate some stuff and I got it to be I got it to work on my first try. I was so I'm so talented. I felt like a god. I've told this story before. I felt like a, like a genuinely, I felt like a god. I was messaging some of my programming friends where I was like, you have no idea. This is insane. And then I realized that the data that I gave the model was just like garbage. It just like, I just got lucky. Um, it basically, I forgot what I was trying to get the model to do, but it, it was basically, it just was flipping a coin and it just so happened to get it right every time. Um, and it was so bad. Like I gave, I gave it more data, um, to, to like that it didn't t train on and it was just wrong 100% of the time. <laughs> and I was like, okay, <laughs> never mind. <laughs> um, but yeah, I, have I done some? Yes, I, I, I enjoy Python machine learning stuff in my bits of free time. So, um, honestly, my heart, the hardest time that I have with any AI related stuff is it feels like a, I can't, once I start training something, I can't stop watching it. And like, I want to just, it's like a game to me. Like, did it, is this run like a roguelike game? Is this run going to be better? Are these training arguments better? Is this data set better? Is it, is, and I just sit there and watch the graphs and like all the tests the whole time. And I just can't stop. And I, I'm like, I'm supposed to just set it. And they're like, well, I should just have this other computer run that while I edit a video or whatever. But then instead I'm like, oh my God, it looks like it's doing, it's look, it looks like it's doing pretty good. For those of you that have ever done that before, perhaps you know what I'm talking about. Anyway, 
So, thanks for listening to my intro. I appreciate you guys. Um, thanks for sticking around. I don't know what I've been talking about this whole time, but I've enjoyed I've enjoyed my stay. Thanks for uh, hanging out with me for a bit. So now let's call some scammers or something. <laughs> I think that's what I'm supposed to be doing. Um. Where no strangers to what Python libraries do? Oh, I probably should. Get, get, stop talking about things because I'll just rant forever about stuff. I think I'll, I mean, I would just play with Hugging Face for now. If you're getting started, there's lots of cool stuff on there. Um, now I'm trying to decide. I think I'm just excited about the, I'm, I'm excited about the gauntlet today, so. Um, I might switch up my plan. Yeah, I was going to do the B-movie. I mean, I said Gauntlet plus B-movie, right? So I can, I mean, I can do whatever I want. I'm just, so, uh, um, one idea I had, just because I think it's silly, is the, if you guys want to help me pick like a bunch of celebrities, maybe we start with like nine, something that would look good in a grid. <laughs> um, I thought, could I? Oh, I just don't know if I. Would. I mean, is it Squidward? No, like for example, uh, to explain this, we've we've had fake Elon Musk, fake Keanu Reeves, and fake Donald Trump all enter the gauntlet, and so now I'm like, well, wait a second. I've also had fake Kiboga, not to say that I'm on par with those other people, but should I not? Uh, make a like could we not try to get f yeah fake taylor swift fake mr beast fake whoever it is all into the gauntlet like right now i bet they're scammers fake obama fake warren buffett whoever they are oh johnny depp i was i was talking to yesterday so i'm curious if we just pick n whatever nine of them and, and like, how quickly could I find them and get them into the, the gauntlet is essentially my, the idea. But I just don't know. Um, it might just be too hard to do all in one. I mean, we'll have to see, I guess. But um, It's like scammer bingo. Nicholas Cage for the memes. <laughs> um, Mark Zuckerberg. I'm sure that they all have scammers. If I if there are scammers pretending to be me, why wouldn't there be scammers pretending to be all those other people? Right. Um, yeah. So it's basically that or the B movie. On my on my mind today. I'll pull. I'll pull it because that's the easiest thing. I'll give the people what they want. I can't pull. Twitch hates me. I can't update my title. I can't create polls. I can't do it. I can't do anything. The mods had to update my stream title. Can you, can mods make a poll for me? It's Pokemon, but with Celeb, can, you gotta catch them all. Exact, you gotta catch them all. Yeah. Let's see. Taylor Swift. Um. I'll just pull up Photoshop. 
I think are we just doing this idea now? Did I did we even do a do we even need <laughs> do we even need a poll? Did I just Hold on. New file. I don't know if I know how to do this in Photoshop. Can you make like a grid programmatically? Uh, I feel like you can. Oh, you can. Okay, number of column. Oh, ooh. Nice. They're not strangers to one another. Yeah, guide layout. Um, I, f I found it. I'll share my screen in a second. Mm -hmm. Uh, new scene. Photo shot. Why is my Photoshop so weird? It's got like... What the heck? Sorry, hold on, I know I don't see anything. Um... It won't let me share... Okay, I'll just make this as we go. Oh, I'm such a bad streamer. <laughs> I don't know how to do like a basic... Streaming things. Um. Anyway, we'll do it this way. New. Someone said Taylor Swift, and uh, there's probably a Taylor Swift scammer out there. So, I'll just start with that one. Let's do. Let's do it. We'll get nine. Nine. Um. Select font. Chuck mm -mm 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 -mm. Norit. I don't. I don't. Hmm. Okay. So. Um, John Cena. All right, The Rock. Ryan. Gosling. Santa Claus. <laughs> okay, I'm just gonna write The Rock. Um, Oprah? 
Johnny Depp. I mean, I already, I'm going to cheat a little bit and do Johnny Depp because I already, oh wait, he got banned. Uh, <laughs> never mind. Um, Billy Nate, uh, what? Gordon, a Gordon Ramsay scammer. I don't, I feel like we might've put Mr. Beast in the gauntlet. I'm just going to Mr. I'll put, I'll, I'll see if we have. Tom Cruise, Tom Brady. I feel like I'm being a little bit, I'm just, I'm seeing names and some of them, like, I'm like, I don't, I don't know who these people are. So I just, uh, uh Obama, do you think there are? We've already kind of gotten Trump in there. I guess we could do that again. Uh, there's probably like a Biden. I'm not, I don't know if we've ever had a Joe Biden in there. Abe Lincoln. Um, hmm. We've already had Keanu Reeves in there. So, I mean, I'll just, I'll just put Trump. Uh, we'll just add them later. <laughs> we'll, we'll cheat. Um, Eminem. Jennifer Lopez. Interesting. Ariana Grande. Okay, fine. I like it. I, I got it. Or I wanted. I got it. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Okay, we need two more. Um, let's do what, who would, who? Steve Harvey. Haven't we? That would be an interesting one. I think we've kind of done, we've already done that, um, in, in like a video. How do you spell it? Is it, did I spell it right? That's embarrassing. What about, um, Who's so someone, someone like in, so we have some, trying to get a mix, to, a mix of different categories of Mr. Beast is the only like the Pope. <laughs> um. Markiplier? I actually did try to find... I haven't found a Markiplier. Uh, I, I, I tried to find some Markiplier um, uh, scammers, but I I haven't had any of them respond to me yet. So... Martha Stewart? Snoop Dogg? Dr. Disrespect? <laughs> Mark Cuban. Oh, is that he say his name? There probably is someone pretending to be him because they're like, oh, he has money to give away to people or something. Right? Is that too Cuban? Cubane? How do you say his name? I don't know. I don't keep up with anything. Listen, just it, it, uh, We've already had, so we've already at, if I, if I were to keep going, we've already had, um, so we've already had Trump. We've already had Elon, um, Keanu. How do you spell his name? Keanu? Is that it? I'm embarrassed. Uh, I don't know how to spell anything. Um, we've already had. Who else? I think we have had Mr. Beast, actually. Did we get... I don't know if we got Jeff Bezos in there. <laughs> but yeah, we've already had... We've already had some of those people, so... Um, we'll, we'll try to get some more. Okay. I wonder if this is actually... This might be tough. Now that I'm now that I'm like, yeah, this is what we're gonna do today. I think the the hard part is so I now need to find them. 
and finding them is not the most um it's like i literally just had to like hunt through facebook and 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 telegram and crap there's not like a lot of <laughs> maybe i can somehow maybe i can multitask I uh, that's like famous last words for Kit Boga. Maybe I can multitask. Kim Kardashian. We'll we'll have some backup. We're in another sixty scammers in sixty. Yeah, I'm now I'm now realizing this is essentially like oh yeah, this is gonna be easy. I'm gonna get all these people in the gauntlet like in one stream, but then. <laughs> I don't know about that. Um, we gotta, definitely can't do more than uh, we should have like three. There should be like three scammers on this list. Not <laughs> okay. Um, Have it, have it as bingo and do it over time. Yeah, I wonder if I do it that way. Like I'll, cause it's gonna be. I need. Okay, I'm just gonna do this. Uh. Yeah, we've definitely had Elon Musk before, so. Just have a Pokédex where you. <laughs> We just, that should be, honestly, that should be it. We just make a big list and, and periodically I just have it, I pick a random number generator and I'm like, well, this is my, this is my target today. We're going to see if we can get, we're going to see if we can get Steve Harvey in the gauntlet. Just like roll a, roll a dice. <laughs> because it's going to be too hard. I think it'll be tricky to get everybody all at once. A Dr. Phil? Yeah, I should just add these. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I kind of like. Judge. These things. No. <laughs> All right. I'm too distracted now. Um. I think I'm gonna. I think I'm gonna try to. The wheel of scammers. I don't think it's gonna take too hard to like find a few of these people. Famous last words. Uh, I think if I just pull up. Facebook, where everyone can, you can find any scammer you need. And I go, I feel like I should have a timer running right now, but, uh, Taylor Swift. One moment. Facebook, the marketplace of scammers. Yeah. What is this? I need like I need like racing music. I need epic music. Okay. So, how hard will it be for me to find Taylor Swift scammers?
Taylor Swift ad friend. Taylor Swift privates. Taylor Swift's private chat. Ad friend. <laughs> this is so stupid. Like, how can Facebook not? Ugh. I don't know if any of them are like like active or not, but. Yeah, they, they, I just don't think they really care. Yeah. Let me see if how bad Telegram is. Taylor Swift. What's her, like, is that her, like, actual name? Or is that just her stage name? Sorry, I don't know anything about Taylor Swift. She, she's, like, kind of a big deal, right? Hey, Taylor Allison? I noticed a lot of scammers will go by full name. Yeah, like, I, I see some... Maybe I'll have to do some, uh, maybe I'll do the B movie. I think this happens to me like every time now. I'm like, oh yeah, 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 this will be great. And then I realize, basically, I probably have to find all these scammers offline. And then, uh, have like a bunch of them have conversations going with all of them. <laughs> and then stream it. Because, um... Yeah, I could, I could just, I could spend an hour just sitting here, uh, looking for all, all the, all the people. Okay, cool. Well, good, good, good plan. We'll do that. Uh, I'll do that later. Oh, although I do have Elon Musk chatting with me now, so... Uh, it should be best for you to invest in my company. I would love to be an inside investor. Pulling up, uh, I'm switching gears. I'm gonna, I'm gonna raise the desk, get the B movie script up. Get, get serious now. Okay.
Does anybody know a tool of like, if I were to, I don't have to like code this. So if I were to put the entire script in some sort of tool and then as I move through the script that shows us like the percentage that I've been, that I've, that I've completed already. That's just like basic math, right? Like I just Excel sheet can <laughs> maybe <laughs> maybe that's what I should do. <laughs> okay. Notepad plus. Uh, actually, uh, yeah. I wonder if something like Sublime does it. Mm -hmm. Yo, uh, what's up, Fire Code Man? Long time YouTube viewer, first time chatter, love your work. Um, hi, thanks for swinging by. What's up? <laughs> oh, I know. This is the probably worst way to do it, but I'm just going to do it. Because it's the fastest thing I know. New Python project. E movie. And I need the script. Got it. I'm almost ready. Uh, if I can remember how to code, I'll, <laughs> I'll do it live. Sure. This is the fast this is the this is such a not probably not the best way to do it but Okay, can you see this? You can. Um, and then I put my face. I'm gonna put put the TQDM, whatever that stands for. I don't know. Ah, where did my where did I go? <laughs> New. And then if I can remember how to uh. Oh, live. I do open script dot text script. Uh, um, as B movie as B, and then. How do you go through the lines for line and 
B read lines is that I bet this is maybe it and then this this might be enough uh so <laughs> I don't know if it'll be big enough uh I'll have to run it elsewhere but now it should really poorly display a progress bar every time I, and I can just press enter every time I do the line. <laughs> and we'll, now we'll know how far along I am. Perfect. We're already done. All right. Um, I think I need to open it in a different file though, because then I can make it bigger. But. <sighs> Gosh, programming. That was some real professional work right there. That was some high quality stuff. How do I open? There it is. I'm almost ready. Do, do, do. How do you change the, do you guys know how to change the size of, okay, never mind. It's so quiet. It's, I mean, it's been my fault because oh, because <laughs> I'm trying to fix this. There. Oh, what happens each time I... I might have done this wrong. What was supposed to be so simple. Oh no, I, I did it. Okay. Let's shake it up a little. Nice. Is that, that'll be big enough for you, <laughs> right? <laughs> it's supposed, yeah, it's supposed to be the iterations per second. <laughs> so, uh, it'll, it's like a, it'll be like a speed, <laughs> it's like a really bad speed run timer. <laughs> It'll give you an estimate of how long, uh, like it's going to take me two. Is it going to take me two hours? An hour, and if I do it really fast, it's only going to take eighteen minutes. It's perfect. It's everything we needed. <laughs> and then, uh, I need to. Well, what did I just do? Oh. I need to see the entire script in front of me, though, because it'll help me. 
I might I might say multiple things. <sighs> okay. I got your submissions up, so. I'm calling a scammer. This, hopefully this is a good one. My my ideal situation is I get through the entire B-movie with one scammer. I don't really want to just, well, well, like one scam call center, you know, not, uh, I don't want to just, oh, well, I left off at line 17 with this one, so let me go on to the next. That's my dream. Are we going through the script? Well, I mean, no. We're gonna also. I'm gonna somehow. I have to somehow maintain the scam call while I do it. I can't just like call a scammer and read the B movie script. <laughs> They're gonna. No. That that's the challenge. If I just read it to them without any explanation it won't it won't go very well at least i don't think Not with that attitude. Please leave your message after the tone. When nah. Well, this will be like our bench. This will be a benchmark. Yeah, thank you for getting connected with Geek Squad. This is Randy Wilson. How can I help you? Hey, hi, Randy. Uh, did you know that according to all known laws of aviation, there's no way a bee should be able to fly? Its wings are too small to get its fat little body off the ground. But the bee, of course, flies anyway, because the bees don't care what humans think is impossible. <laughs> so you are calling you the Geek Squad? Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Uh, I work with Bug, Bug Facts Unlimited, and um, I'm, I'm calling about my Geek Squad wow. submission. My Geek Squad, uh, I sorry. Think, I, uh, I think you dialed the wrong number. Thank you. But but I have a Geek Squad subscription. Uh, I can give you my customer ID number. It's yellow, black, yellow, black, yellow, black, yellow, black. Oh, black and yellow. Sorry. <laughs> Let's shake it up a little, Randy. <laughs> okay, so he hung up. That's your benchmark. Uh, I can't just say, I can't just say the words. You gotta, you gotta kind of. <laughs> I don't know. Also, apparently, it would take me three hours at that rate, which maybe this is a little harder than I thought it would be. But um, we'll see. Just say the entire script. That's cheating. There are no rules. I'm just trying to do a 100% run, you know? <sighs> Let's see. I can't believe I made it. Whatever. Uh, doesn't it make sense that it would take at least 50% just to read? 
baby? Like, how long is the movie? Yeah. The, oh, is my record getting 17% of the way? Another call coming in? Oh, jeez. I also think I have a... It's fine, it's fine, it's fine. This will be our run. It doesn't matter. Don't don't get me distracted with, with those things. Thanks for calling support. My name is Roger. How may I help you today? Uh, what? Hello? Your call has been landed to the other. My name is Roger. How may I help you today? Yes, yes, yes. He was saying, it sounds like his phone's under the under a rug. <laughs> Thanks for calling your back. This is Roger. How may I help you? No, Roger. <laughs> Did he say a vast? Yeah, I think this was to be. Go on. Thank you for calling Norton Life Log. This is Hazel. I'm Mrs. Tickadin. Yeah, hi. What did you say your name was? Sorry, I didn't quite. Uh, didn't quite catch it. Uh, my name is Zach. Jack Zach? Cato. How may I help you, sir? Jack, J A C K. Oh, Jack. Nice to meet you, Jack. Uh, how, how are you? I'm, I'm calling in about my uh, subscription here. Just got an email from you guys. And uh, need some okay. help. Need some help with that. Yes. So, first of all, I do believe you received an email from the company in regards to some yeah. order, right? And uh -huh. can you just help me out with the invoice number or the customer ID number? Yeah, let me see. I, I printed it out. I know I left it somewhere. Oh, God. There's a... There's a B. There's a B in my... There's a bee in my office right now. I don't want to hold on a second. I printed the paper out with the information on it, but there's a there's a bee by it, and I, I'm I'm allergic to bees. You know, according to all known laws of aviation, there's no way a bee should be able to fly because its wings are too small to get its fat little body off the ground. It's crazy. You know, the bee of course flies anyway because bees don't care what humans think is impossible, but I'm just saying bees are fascinating creatures. Uh, okay, okay, I got I got the email in front of me. I got the email in front of me. What do you what information did you need? Your invoice number. Okay, the invoice uh, number should be yellow, black, yellow, black, yellow, black, yellow, black. Oh, sorry, black and yellow. Oh, shoot. Sorry, let's shake it up a little. I'm sorry. That was the wrong... I was reading the wrong part. It's B is in baby, A is in alpha, R is in rhino, R is in rhino, Y, uh, Barry. Um, 713-79. Okay. So you want to cancel out your subscription, sir? Yeah, breakfast is ready, baby. I want to get this thing canceled. Okay, so kindly just take your time and be next to your computer or your cell phone so I can help you out. Okay, I'm coming. Hang on a second. Hello? <laughs>
Barry? Yes, sir. Adam? Yes. Are you there? Yes, sir. Okay. Um, I'm in front of my computer. Can you believe this is happening? I didn't expect to be charged for this. I can't. Just open up your Google Chrome page. Okay. I'll pick you up. You're looking sharp. Let me open up Google Chrome. Uh, oh gosh, she hung up. Yeah, this, I'm I'm I'm, going, I'm too ambitious. I'm too ambitious. Just throwing things out there. Uh, let's see. I just realized I don't even have my. I feel like I did that with one of the guys though. Um, where did my virtual? This part is really hard, though. The next, this part's tough. Whether like getting ready to graduate or whatever. Mm -mm -mm. I I think I need. Let's see if this works. If that wasn't. Hello. <laughs> Hello. Yeah, hi. Uh, hi, my name is Alex. I'm calling from Dad Advisor. How are you? Yeah, Alex. Do you have 15% or more uh, debt? All right. Would you like Would you like my help uh, saving 15% or more on your debt? Sir, actually, I'm calling you in regards that we are running a nationwide campaign to help people to reduce their unsecured loan up to 50%, and also help you to qualify for our debt relief program. Oh, I would like eliminate a, your debt. I would like a loan. How about you, Alva? Can I have a loan? Sorry. Well, are you saying Sorry, you're saying that you could give me a loan? I can give you a loan. Yeah, is that what you said? You're doing a nationwide campaign to give to do loans. All right, sir. Have a good day. Okay. I guess I misunderstood. I thought that's what he said. Why is it? I feel like the, f the phone is already bad. The connection to that call center is already hmm. let's try this Hello. 
Yeah, hello? Hello? Yes, sir. Hi. This is yeah. Alex Thompson. How can I help you today? Hello? Hello? Yes, sir. How can I help you? Can you hear me? It's kind of, the connection is kind of bad. Is this, uh, sorry, I'm trying to get in touch with Microsoft. This is Microsoft. Can you hear me now? Not really, no. Uh, okay, just leave me this number. I will call you back right away. I'll try to call back. I'll, try, I'll call back. Sorry, let me... Uh, You can give me a number, I'll call you. Wow. Um, let me try again here. I don't think, I've had some phone calls that were not a disaster, so I don't think it's me, but. Hello? Hello. How can I help you? Yeah, I need some help. Oh, this is actually Chase. They're pretending to be Chase. Oh, I actually need to talk to these guys. This is like a new scam. Shoot. <laughs> Can you hear me okay? Shoot. Th this is actually something I haven't seen. I like accidentally, I didn't even. This is a, this is a like Microsoft pop-up, but they're running it on a fake, on top of a fake Chase bank website. So it, I, huh. So, I think I just heard her say that this is Chase. Which means they're like... Oh, and remember that guy... Remember that scammer who gave me, like, information a while ago? He was talking about... This is one of the things we were talking about. That the scammers have been, like, talking about um, uh, banking banking related... Uh, pop-ups, and I haven't been able to find one yet. So I don't know if I'm doing the B-movie. <laughs> uh, apparently I have to update PyCharm because I have the 2020 version running right now. <laughs> but I might not be doing the B-movie anymore. <laughs> if I can figure out... Let me call myself. Um, I might have to figure this one out. I want to make sure it's not my phone. ADD powers activate. Well, I mean, yes, but also it's kind of important. Um, I gotta call myself. Okay, sorry, I, I'm, I'm doing a bunch of things now. Hello. Hello? 
Hello? Hello? Hello? Hello? Hello? Hello? Oh no. Oh no. Oh no. I might have been I might have been calling them Oh no. I'm think I'm calling them as the gauntlet. No 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 no. No no no. I think I might have been my outbound number might have been the gauntlet one eight hundred number. So if they were trying to call me back, okay, because uh, I just got a call from a 1-800 number when I called myself. Oh, jeez. But that's okay. That's fine. I'm trying to log in here. Okay. <laughs> yeah, I'm definitely calling from the gauntlets number. So that that's a blunder. This should be better. Um, whoops. A secretary of phone numbers. <laughs> I don't know if that'll make the quality any better. That's on their end, but. Thank you for calling support. You're speaking with David. How can I help you? Uh, it's a little hard to hear you. Uh, but can you hear me? Yes, sir, I can hear you. I'm trying to get in touch can with hear me? Uh, Chase Online Support, please. Why, well, sir, you are connected with. How can I help you? Uh, I was trying to log into my bank and and I got a message about my PC being blocked. Hey, uh, when did you receive this message? Is it right now? Huh? Uh, when did you receive this message? Is it right now? Okay. <laughs> Why, sir, can you just read out yeah, I mean, the I message? Can't, what you I, can see on the screen? I think it's just them. read out the complete message? I think it might be them. Um, I mean, it means that anyone calling in probably hears this too. But... Hello? Uh, the, the phone is breaking up, sir. I have no idea what what you're saying. Can, can you okay, still hear me? Uh, speaking on your cell phone? Yeah, you this is my cell phone. phone. Or is your land for the Hold on, sir, just a moment. To receive a call, my direct line, sir. Just after the call. Hello? Hello? Anyone there? <laughs> I mean, I'm. I want to know what they're doing because I I haven't seen this before. But they might just. It might be so new that they don't have all this stuff set up. Like maybe they. Also, if they're, if they're doing if it's Chase specifically, they're gonna think that I'm that I have a Chase bank account, which I <laughs> which I don't. Uh, so that'll be an interesting 
if they want to connect to my computer and stuff, I can just be like, well, I actually don't really have any money in my chase. I moved it all to Bank of America or something. But. Are you sure it didn't say Jess? Yeah, I'm sure because I'm looking at the virus pop up and the picture behind the virus pop up is the Chase website. Um, and the domain name has Chase in it. So they are definitely pretending to be Chase. It's 100%. It looks like the typical virus pop up that I've seen over the past four years, but also Chase is involved in it. Um, so I, I'm, yeah, really interested in. Uh, talking to these guys. Announcement. Yeah, hello. This is Chase Saporto. You're speaking with David. We got disconnected. Is it better right now? Can you hear me? Oh, y yes. This is this is better. Uh, you, you said this is David from Chase Support. Uh mm -hmm. Yes. Yes, sir. Okay. Uh, you said you. that your computer get blocked. Yeah, I was trying to get on my banking because I've been, you know, doing a moving some money around and wanted to make sure that I had had, had did that successfully. Mm -hmm. And uh, mm -hmm. I I was trying to get on my Chase account just to make sure it went the transfer went through, and then. Um, Mm -hmm. I, I got this message here saying my computer is blocked. Mm -hmm. I, okay, I, what I kind of computer are you using? Like, is it a desktop or laptop? Yeah, it's a, it's a Dell. It's a Windows Dell. Yeah, right? What is the make and model? It's a Windows Dell. Are you in front of the computer right now? I, yes, sir. I am. Can you just read, can you read out the complete message, what you can see, just read out the complete message? Yeah. Microsoft Windows Firewall Alert. PC infected with mm -hmm. Trojan type spyware. Access mm -hmm. to this PC has been blocked for security reasons. Mm -hmm. Call Chase mm -hmm. Online Support and then it has your phone number. All right, got you, sir. Uh, in order to pull up all the information, sir, can you help me? How do you spell your first and last name? Yep. Uh, I My first name is Ronald. That's R-O-N-A-L-D. Mm -hmm. mm -hmm. And my last name is Andrews. A-N-D-R-E-W-S. D, you said the first letter is B? No, A is in uh, Andrew. Andrew, right? Yeah, Ronald Andrews. The third. And your zip code, sir? 44138. Uh, you have a full name as Ronald Andrews. Do you have any middle initial? F. What is the middle initial? F. Uh, like, pre like press F. To pay respect, just the letter F. F, right? F like yeah. Frank? Mm hmm. Mm hmm. Oh, just stay on the line, so let me go ahead and check it for you. Thank you. You're welcome, sir. Uh, the city name that I can see is Almasted Falls, Ohio, right? Yes, sir. Born and raised. Mm -hmm. Just stay with me, just a couple of seconds. Thank you. 
Uh, for context, this is what I'm talking about. So the, the, the message kind of looks like the typical pop up, but then it's got Chase in the background and it says call Chase online support. Uh, and then the URL has chase in it so my guess is they're potentially running ads for people trying to log into chase you or, said your middle initial or it's like a misspelling of chase like frank right? hello uh, yes sir f like frank All right, I'll call you back. I'll call you back. Okay, so I can just uh, get all the updates from my backend team that there is a breach in your network connection. Do you know anything about it? No, it's a little hard to understand what you're saying. There's a breach in your network connection, like somebody is trying to access your information, and there's a reason. For the security reason, your system has get blocked, sir, right? Oh my God. We will try to help you out. Don't need to worry for that. Oh my God. Yeah, I, I, I didn't, I didn't know there was a, I didn't know there was a problem with mm -hmm. that. Okay. So right now, sir, as you can understand that uh, there is a breach in your network connection. So first, you need to diagnose a problem because for the secure reason, Microsoft has blocked the access on your computer. And I'm assuming you do online banking in your phone as a, uh, in your computer as well, right? Yeah, sir. Can you take last night's Halloween candy out of your mouth, though? It's 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 hard to tell what you're saying. I'm just saying, sir. You do online banking, shopping using your computer, right? Yes, I, I do online you do banking. Online. Yes, and that's the reason, sir, for the security. The Microsoft has blocked all the access in this computer because your network connection has been compromised. Now, in order to fix these issues, I'm just going to help you with few comments that you need to follow and you need to diagnose a problem. Okay. In order to secure the system, first we need to connect your system with a secure server so that we can help you and you can diagnose a problem by yourself. Okay. Oh, okay. Now, Thank you. I right appreciate now, that, sir. Uh, what is? Thank you. You're welcome, sir. Right now, what can you see on the computer screen, sir? Uh, well, I right now I'm just on the home. I I did a, I did do a quick restart of the computer because I remember my grandson always told me to restart the computer if I ever had any problems. Mm -hmm. And so I'm just now, mm -hmm. I'm just, it's at the login screen. Your grandson? How old are you also? Oh, uh, me? I'm 78 years old. Oh my goodness. You sound very young. Oh, <laughs> thank you. I thought, well, Tell that to my wife. Years old. She she doesn't think so. Oh hi. Oh my goodness. I was confused. I thought that would be like fifty fifty five like anything like that. Oh yeah. If you were to take that gobstopper out of your mouth, you'd sound younger too. <laughs> <laughs> oh man. Anyway. So, uh, is should I log into my right now? log in? Yeah, just log in. Okay. You know, we did a little thing last night. Uh, do you sell a, You do a Halloween thing there at the office? Does everybody dress up or anything? 
לא, סדר כל היום. אוקיי. מה אתה מתכוון? אנחנו לא יודעים איזה כאילו... אנחנו לא יודעים איזה כאילו... אנחנו לא יודעים איזה כאילו... אוקיי. אני לוגד אין למי קומפיוטר, ואני רואה משהו שאומר ווינזיפ. פיול ושקר את הדעלי עבודה. With the all okay. new WinZip. Sorry? I don't know. I'm just going to close out of it. I've, uh, never subbed, never donoed. All right. Uh, Add block on. You have a Windows key. You have a Windows key on your computer. Do you see the Windows key at the le- left-hand side, yeah. bottom corner of the keyboard, the Windows key? Yes, sir. Press the Windows key, press the Windows key, hold it down, and with holding the Windows key, at the same time, press the letter R as in Romeo, and let me know what do you see. Okay. Roger that. Uh, window key and the... Windows the, and R. Which button? Window, windows and which button? R as in Romeo. Okay, sir. It says the type letter. the name of a program, folder, document. or internet oh, resource and perfect. windows no. will open it for you release release your fingers from the keyboard affirmative and in the open box you can see there is a long address bar just beside open you can type something right just beside open yes sir is it empty or something is already typed in it's it's empty You need to type over there three W's, www. Okay. Then put a dot like a period. www dot? Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Okay. Then type the letter U as an unicorn. Okay. Then... L as in Lima. Okay. T as in Tango. Okay. R as in Romeo. Okay. E as in Alpha. Okay. V as in Victor. Uh-huh. I as in Indigo. Uh-huh. E as in Echo. Uh-huh. W as in Whiskey. Okay. E as in Echo. Okay. R as in Romeo. Uh-huh. Then put a dot, like a period. Dot com? Yeah. No, no. Dot net. N-E-T. N as in Nancy. E as in Echo. T as in Texas. Okay. N-E-T. Can you read it out? What did you type, sir? It says uh, ultraviewer.net. Perfect. Now hit enter from your keyboard. Press enter key using your keyboard. Okay. Now what do you see? It opened up. Uh, it's opening up something. All right. Mm-hmm. Um, okay, it opened up a web page. Mm-hmm. You'll see a new page is popping up. There's Ultra Viewer. Yes. Do you see that? Yes, sir. If you look at the left-hand side, you can see there is a green box which says Download. 
Do you see the download? The it doesn't. Green? This doesn't look oh. like Chase.com though. This is this is different. This says. Yes, we are just trying to support connecting you with the support team so okay. that they can fix the issue. So why? The backend oh, okay. team will help you with that. Do you see the green this box here? Download. As well. But I mm -hmm. do see download. It should be in green color, right? At the left hand side. Yeah. 40 million downloads. Click on that. Click on that. Click to download the file. Okay. Now, what do you see? Um, recent down. Oh, it's in my downloads. Mm -hmm. Something is downloading, right? Yeah, I see Ultra Viewer one, two, three, four, five, six. I think I might have clicked. I think I downloaded it six times. Whoops. Oh, can you open any one of them? Yeah. Which is already downloaded. This is free, right? I'm not going to have to pay for it each time I download yes. it. No, 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 sir. You don't need to pay. No, no, you don't need to pay anything. Don't need to worry. Okay. Did you open it? Yeah, I'm, op I'm opening that now. Let's see. You want to allow this app to make changes? Yes, yes. Click on yes. It so says right warning. You At are least 12 to the megabytes structure. of disk space is required. Is that a lot? Mm -hmm. Okay. Did you click on yes, allow? Okay. Next, would you like to add a yes, desktop? Yes, you need to click on next, next. Mm -hmm. Okay, just next, next, next. Then you need to click on finish. Uh, whoever does the interior decorating, it's Christmas now. Can we get... Hold on. Sorry, I was talking to... I live in an old folks home. Mm -hmm. Did you click on finish? Or install anything? Install anything like that? It says registering service right now. Okay, all right. Completing the Ultra Viewer setup wizard. Mm -hmm. Setup is finished. Installing Ultra Viewer. Once it is once it is done, you will be getting a temporary ID and the password from the support team. Okay. Once you are on the page, let me know. Once you see your ID and your password. Uh. Okay. You see your ID and the password if you have received from the support team. Hello. Yeah, sorry, I'm new at this. It's telling me mm -hmm. I have. It's it's telling me. Huh. I think I installed the wrong thing, sir. This doesn't look like my bank. This says... This says control a remote computer and allow remote control. I don't know. If... <laughs> yes, because you are connecting to the support team, sir. The backend team he is going to safeguard all of your information. They are just trying to fix the issues because I said your network connection has been compromised, right? So they will take okay. you to the secured server. They will help you with all these things, all right? You don't need to worry. Nobody is trying to get inside your information. Now, you see your ID, right? Yeah. You see that? Yeah, but what the okay. heck is that for? Can you just read out the ID number? Sorry? What the heck is that ID for? That's not... I've never seen this. Uh... 
you will see everything in front of you sir right all the information will be in front of you only you can see all those things i will navigate you with some tip and you can check it by yourself right we are just going to help you out i can't now, hear what can you're you saying sir number? i'm just saying sir right now i'm just going to help you to diagnose the problem we need to check it by yourself we are only here to help you out okay our back end team will take care of everything so that this problem will not you need to you never face in the uh, future everything will get fixed so right okay now you have received your id and the password right yes can you just read out the id number yep it's uh, Okay. Oh, I still can you hear me? <laughs> Barely, it's really hard to hear you. <laughs> all right, sir. Now, I have sent all this information to our backend team. Those are working on your system to fix the issues as well. Now, what you need to do, I'm just going to guide you with few simple steps so that you can check the network status of your computer. Now, what you need to do, again, you need to press the Windows key along with the letter R with the both keys. The windows and the letter R, okay. what you have done earlier. Yeah. Now you see the run box. Is, sir, is this... Uh, okay. So... Is this... Can I tr talk to your manager, please? Why do you wish to speak with my manager, sir? I'm just having a hard time working with you. You are not getting my voice? If I could talk to a manager, please. Okay, hold on, sir. Here I Yes, sir. Yeah. Hello. Hello. Yes, sir. I'm here. Uh, I just told him he is busy with something else. All right. Uh, he will be on the line very soon, sir. I'm just telling you see the run box, right? Oh, yes. You see the run box, and uh, in the run box, just beside open, is there anything is written or is it empty? In the open, is it empty or something is it written? It says ultraviewer.net. Okay, can you delete that and make that panel empty? Uh, Just okay. delete everything from the open box. And you need to type over there C as in Charlie. Uh -huh. M as in Mary. Uh-huh. ID as in Delta. Okay. It will be CMD, right? Now hit enter from your keyboard. Press enter key. 
Okay. Now what do you see? Now what do you see? Windows cannot find GMD, it says. No, no, it's not G, sir. It should be C. C as in Charlie. CMD. Just press the Windows and R together. Uh, okay. The Windows. So you said it was SMH my head? What did you say? Did you open the run box? Make the open box empty. Just make that panel empty. Now, yes, yes, God. Do oh. you see anything? Yes. See user's personal. Is it, I'm trying to be patient because, like, you see that, right? Okay, are they doing uh, a new scan? This is a Microsoft Corporation. But it kind of feels like <laughs> where you can check the network status. It's the of same your computer, scam, just like a uh, new user who is your internet with service Chase. provider. Is it Comcast, Verizon, ABC, like I, was, I was thinking they might do something intense, like, let me get you right away over to a Chase representative. Um, some some real crazy thing. Hello. But, I'm, I'm listening. Hello. It's just hard to understand you because your phone. I'm asking, who is your internet service provider? Is it Comcast, Verizon? ADT, Spectrum, Xfinity, who yeah. is your internet service it's provider? Spectrum. Spectrum, right? Uh -huh. And apart from this computer, how many devices are linked with your Wi-Fi connection? 77. Sorry? I think 77. What, 77? You asked how old I was when I bought this device? No, 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 sir. I'm asking that, like, apart from this computer, in yeah. how many devices you use internet connection? Like, is it your phone? Is it an Android phone? Oh. Is it an iPhone? What kind of phone you're using? It, yeah, it's a cell phone. Cell phone. Um, and you use the same network connection that you are using in your computer, right? Yeah. Okay. Now, in that black box, you can see that you can, it's a secured server where we can see that the network status of your computer, how is it running, okay? So just uh -huh. see on the line, I'm just going to guide you with a step. Uh, you need to type over there, you can see the cursor is blinking at man. the center, right? Yeah, no, I Sorry? see it. I see it. You, you need to type over there the letter N as a Nancy. I'm going to type. Okay. Did you type? Then E as an echo. Well, I can save 85%. E is an echo. Did you type? Then T as in tango. Ooh, yeah. Halloween festivities. Teas and tango. <laughs> F as in fam. F as in fam. T as in tango. T as in tango. E as in apple. G as in gecko. No, no, sir. It's A as an Why alpha. It's this? not G. A as an alpha. Oh. You are checking the network status of your computer. Is it running secure or not? You will see in front of you, right? A as an apple. And then what? T as in tango. The last letter will be T. T as in tango. It will two, be two next T's? stack. N three T. I'm sorry? How many T's at the end? <laughs> Three T's? One T, sir. Oh, one T. One, one T. Okay. Uh, okay. Now you need to present it. 
you need to press enter over oh, so right now i am just going to transfer your call to my manager he is available right now he is going to guide you with further over right, so oh thank god just stay on the line i'm connecting you with my manager okay okay thank you sir mm -hmm. Oh, checkmate, atheist. Man. Thank you for holding line. Your line has been transferred uh, to the uh, senior manager. And my name is Tim Snyder. Am I speaking with Mr. Andrews? Yes. Yeah, nice to meet you, James. All right, can you hear me, sir, now clearly? Hello. Yeah. So can you hear me? Okay, all right. And uh, I believe uh, you went on to uh, run a network statistic check uh, on your computer. And once you hit the enter button, can you see like anything like active connections? Yeah, sir, this is the senior manager for Chase. Yes, sir. Okay. And do uh, you see anything like active connections? Um, yes, sir. I see local address and uh, foreign address. And when you uh, try to log into your online banking, uh, you received a, a message that your computer, you cannot access uh, your computer. Am I right, sir? Uh-huh. Okay, all right. And now... Uh, I want you to uh, oh. click on just give me a minute. Okay, take your time. Can I talk to the senior vice president or like the the CEO? Yes, minute, sir. I'm working on your uh, information. Okay. Did you know bees, uh, like according to all known laws of aviation, bees shouldn't be able to fly? I learned that. Its wings are too small to get its fat little body off the ground. Can you hear me, sir, now? Yeah, can you hear me? Yes, sir. Uh, I want you to uh, 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 type in, I want you to press Windows and then the letter R. Okay. Yeah, I so said, did you, I was watching a documentary last night. Uh... Uh, okay, I want you to press the Windows uh, key and the letter R. About bees. Okay. I said, according to all known laws of aviation, there's no way a bee should be able to fly. And I, mm -hmm. I thought that was interesting. Okay. I, Windows and... Okay, now I, I, yeah, now I want you to type in there. There? W W W yes sir no no W W W dot I want you to uh, make everything blank sir now right now please blank everything sir no no do not type blank I'm asking you you need to completely erase uh, the uh, thing whatever you have typed in over there. Oh, 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 like, like, okay, start okay. over. Now I want you to type in W, 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 
dot C C is in Charlie H is in Henry uh-huh. A is in Alpha uh-huh. S is in Sam okay. E is in Edward uh-huh. and dot C O M. I'm connecting to our Chase Secure Server. Click on OK. Okay. Uh, this one doesn't always work. I gotta and go. Are you trying to go to the web page? I can. Yeah, you can go to the Google Chrome web page where you uh, check in your balance Chase. on the case. Yes, sir. I want you to check in again whether you can able to uh, check your information. Okay. So now, what were you what, what were you saying? Like uh, I was trying to check your balance. Of your chase earlier, am I right? Well, yeah, I clo so I actually closed my Chase account, and I opened up a Bank of America account, and I was just double checking that all my money okay. was, that it was still closed. Because since your computer has been um, accessed, I want you to check uh, whether everything is working normal as well. You can check your Bank of America account and to let me know okay. everything you receive from Chase or not. Yeah, so my, my neighbor, Cheryl, she switched over to mm -hmm. the 6G account and Bank of America and she kind of turned me on to it. I, I'd never heard of it before. But okay. As soon as I made the, you know, as soon as I heard about it, I made the switch. Uh, mm -hmm. No offense. I know you work for Chase and everything, but. Yes, sir. But we need to make sure everything is uh, working fine and good. Yeah. I want that confirmation. Hey, did you know that according to all known laws of aviation, there's no way a bee should be able to fly? I beg your pardon? What did you say, sir? I said according to all known laws of aviation, there's no way a bee should be able to fly. Because its wings are too small to get its fat little body off the ground. The bee, of course, flies anyway, because bees don't care what humans think is impossible, but... I find that fact quite interesting. Okay, you can uh, okay, you can check and do let me know, sir. You're my favorite person. Mm -hmm. Okay. Let me see if I can log in here. You ever get bored with your job? No, it's not like that, sir. I'm uh, very much uh, happy to uh, uh, serve people when they face some tough times on their financial uh, paths. You like helping them? You sound, no mm -hmm. offense, but you sound bored out of your mind. But that's okay. I mean, you don't once have to. You have, uh, <laughs> okay, once you check your Bank of America account, uh, you can do let me know, sir. Okay. I'm just uh, uh, submitting the information uh, to the Chase server as well. Yeah, let them know that I closed my account. Mm hmm. <laughs> Uh-oh. Hold on. Mm-hmm. 
me see if I can get my pass. I might have done the wrong password. So what are we trying? What are we trying to do exactly? Perhaps since uh, you would try to uh, venture into do a check your banking information and I believe all these informations have been uh, cracked up and someone is trying to access your information. It's and cracked? from our back end, uh, we, have, yeah, we have just cleared, cleared up as of now. That is why I just want you to go ahead and check everything is working normal and uh, I do not find any kind of an unusual transactions as well, sir. Okay. Okay, yeah, let me see. I'm just looking for you my... Can Check. Mm -hmm. Just looking for my password. Give me one second. Okay. You married? Yes, sir. I have two kids. Oh, no kidding. How old are they? How old are they? I'm 47 years. No, no, I, I, no, no, I was saying how old are, how old are the kids? It's like uh, 14 years and like 11 years. Wow. No kidding. Hmm. Okay. My internet's, I can't get to Bank of America. I can't get to Bank of America. Okay, never mind. I got it. Okay. Bank of America. You turned off your computer, sir? No, sir. I was having it. Because it is saying it is saying like the connection has been lost. Uh, I'm on here right now. I was having some problems. I'm, I tried to get back on the web page and it said cannot connect to the internet, but it seems to work. It could be my Wi-Fi. Sometimes I have Wi-Fi problems. You know the neighborhood, mm -hmm. the neighborhood kids. Mm -hmm. Might be the problem with the Wi-Fi. That's the reason. Okay. <clears throat> so you got a 14-year-old and an 11-year-old? Did you say, or or what? Yes. Yes, sir. <laughs> You take them, uh, did you guys do any trick or treating last night? I beg your pardon, sir. What did you ask? Did you guys go trick or treating last night? No, sir. I'm not getting it clear. No, you don't celebrate Halloween? Oh, shoot. <laughs> oh, my gosh. After mm -hmm. I don't have my. I'm uh, not allowed to speak anything about uh, my personal uh, life uh, over this recorded line, sir. One second. Okay, sorry, my internet's just. I got a blank page right now. My internet's so slow. I think it's the Wi Fi. Okay. Okay, all right. But yeah, I don't. I don't want you to you have to talk about any of your uh, personal things if you don't want to. And because we are not allowed to share any of your personal information, sir, because this is a recorded line, in which if in case uh, something went wrong, they'll be monitoring uh, the conversation as well, sir. If you are uh, seeing a black, like a white page, you can try to refresh the page, sir. Refresh it. Like you can refresh, yeah, refresh the page. How do I do that again? Like on the very top right hand, left hand side, uh, you can oh, see one. a circle which has not been completed with an arrow. Yes. Oh, that was it. That's it. That's it. That did the trick. Oh, yeah, sometimes you. it happens, sir. 
Checking a code. You can. Mm-hmm. You can go ahead and uh, check. Uh, did you found any kind of unusual transactions on your account? Yeah, the last transaction that you made on it. I don't use it. Don't use the account too much. So. Okay. Looks like the last one was Jagex. Eleven dollars, by the way. Is it still eleven dollars? Uh, um. What should I be looking for? You can check your statements and everything that everything is was good and there was no any unusual uh, transactions happened uh, on your account uh, because uh, we need to make sure everything goes good and fine. Everything looks good to me. Just give me a moment here, ma'am. Go ahead. Go ahead. Yeah, everything looks fine. Glad I, good thing and, I switched uh, to Bank of America. The only, yes. account, mm-hmm, the only bank account that you deal with is only with the Bank of America one, right? Yeah, I closed my Chase account a couple weeks ago. Okay. Um. All right, sir. Uh, let me uh, go ahead and uh, update these informations as well to our uh, background backend team. And uh, the mailing address, what I have here is 2122. Uh, say, say that again. Yeah, can you say the whole address again? Sorry. Olmstead Falls? I don't know. I don't know what you're saying. I don't know what you're saying. Um, should I call? Should I just call Bank of America? You think? Uh, are you still there? Hello? So he said, like, is your address, and then he listed out this random address. It was in Ohio. I don't know where he's getting this address from. It will take like two to three minutes, sir. I'm submitting the information. Oh, okay. So I want you to be uh, stay connected with me. And if in case uh, we are disconnected, I'll be calling from this direct line number, sir. You don't want to call up on any other numbers. Okay. All right. And apart from you, sir, is there anyone else who have an access of your computer? Not that I know of. Just my grandkids sometimes. Okay. You, okay, your grandkids does sometimes. And uh, how many people are there, sir, in your household? Like, uh, they usually connect the same Wi-Fi network? I don't, 
Yeah, well, it depends. Like during the holiday, like yesterday, we did the whole shebang, right? We got the uh, we got the the whole family together for Halloween dinner, and then uh, okay. You know, uh, we, so there could have been at least fifteen people on the on the weed feed last night. Mhm. Yes, exactly. Okay, and uh, right now we were not at your residence, sir, or are you somewhere outside? No, I'm at I'm at my house right now. By the way, what do you think about almond joy? Uh, sir, I need to fill up a form, and I uh, were uh, moving out of the track. I need to first let me fill up the form, then I will come back to you, sir. Okay. So there are some few verification questions that I need to ask, and right now you are uh, not at your house. Am I right, sir? No, I'm at I'm at my house right now. Oh, I see what you're saying. You are in your house. Sir. No, 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 no. I'm I'm not a I thought you were asking if I own my house, but no, I'm I'm not at my house right now. I'm traveling. Okay. If he looks up my IP address, I'm in California right now, so I don't know if he's that I'm smart. Traveling right now with your family, right? Uh, yeah, yeah. My son lives in California, but uh, I'm I just no one else is here though. Uh, I. And uh, when you'll be back to your home, sir? Next month. I this is my I live uh, I have a second home in California, so I some I do my I winter second in home. Yeah, I do. I I'm a I'm a snowbird, so I go to California for the snow in the winter time. It's a timeshare. Why do you ask? Okay, all right. And uh, because I can see uh, your laptop uh, uh, device has been accessed from different, different locations. That's what we are uh, con confused. Oh. Yeah, I, I read into that way too much. He's just, it's just a part of his script. He's going to be and like, yeah. Like, uh, there's people accessing. Will you be able to uh, still drive a car, sir? Like, what if, the heck you, is that? if you oh, want, uh, uh, if you uh, come to our branch uh, to provide some information, so will that be possible? Hello. Uh, what do you need me to do? Go to the local branch? No, uh, not call the local. Will you be able to like uh, um, uh, visit the local branch uh, if in case uh, if you need any other information, sir? Will you be able to come over there? Yeah, if you need. Do you want me to go down to the Bank of okay, America? Sure. Not with the Bank of America, sir. With uh, Chase, because we are uh, we do okay. have some more funds as well left under your name as an interest received. That is why. And um, you can you still drive a car, sir? Of course, I can drive. Yeah, yeah. Okay, all right, and. Uh, you do have your own vehicle as well, right? Yeah, I mean barely, but but yeah, yeah. Uh, we'll, uh, we'll get you okay. <laughs> all right, so uh, let me go ahead and submit all these informations uh, uh, to the um, uh, security administration team. I'll be getting in touch with you sir, within the next uh, uh, three to five minutes. If in case the call was okay. disconnected, you can save. This number, you can save this number on your cell phone. Okay, I'll work on, you I'll work on doing that. While well, you work on doing whatever you're okay, doing. All okay, right. all right. Just take a minute. Can I put you on hold for a minute? I'm getting a call from my uh, my neighbor. So give me give me one second. Okay, all right. <laughs> Oh. 
Oh. I was getting a call from someone on Facebook, but now they're not answering. <laughs> Mm. Okay. Check. Uh, you still you still there? Hello? Hello? Oh, you're still probably working on the... on the thing. All right, well, I'm just going to, like, wait for him for a minute, I guess. But this is a little bit... I was kind of expecting... Um, I don't know. If I'm honest, I was expecting a little bit more put together uh, scam. <laughs> like, if they're running... They've got, like, a fake chase domain. They've got this chase-themed thing. It seemed like quite the opportunity for them to do something um, new or, or kind of scary. So it was like, okay. But I don't know if he's prepping something now. I'll give him a minute. Uh, are you still there, sir? Hello? I'll just call him back. Ooh. Leave a message after the beep. Hello? So leave a message? Leave a message after the beep. All right. Well, man, uh, if he calls, I guess I assume he's gonna call me back. He said if we get disconnected, he'd call back. But uh. All right, one second.
Hmm. I'll just play Fish Tycoon. Oh, I don't think I have Fish Tycoon on this snapshot. Oh, I do. He's getting ready to put you on with the bank. Yeah, sometimes it takes them a really long time to figure out how to do that. That could potentially be it. Bonnie Moon. Hello. Wait, this was in your recommended? Your recommended, like, Twitch streams? Do they do that? <laughs> That's interesting. <laughs> I didn't know they do that. <laughs> um... Yeah, I feel like that was a little bit of a anticlimactic hour there. For those of you just getting here, I, I, they there were some scammers. Uh, well, it looks like this. I'll show it to you. Um, so they were running a, a, a fake virus pop-up that looks like this. So this part is pretty normal like I've seen this for years but then this one was different because they added call chase online support and then the background of the web website is chase and my assumption is that they were running this on the Google ads or um looks like MS paint well yeah I scratched off I I I I used MS Paint to block out the number. Um, so I called them because I was thinking, oh, maybe they're going to do some new crazy chase-related script. Like there's going to be some new thing they were doing. And they really haven't done anything <laughs> of interest. Like anything new. Any Anyway. Uh, and then they just hung up. Or, well, I hung up because I couldn't hear them. My guess is that they're going to call me back at some point, but... Let's see what else we've got. This person, um, let me just ask how many scammers are in the gauntlet today? Um, you know, I, I don't know the answer right now. I can check. Oh, we just, <laughs> we just got a great little, <laughs> someone's in there drawing right now. There's a couple scammers, so um, someone's trying to pass the human verification and had to draw a robot. This actually isn't that bad of a robot. Uh, in the beginning of the stream, I was showing someone was drawing some stuff this, last night for a couple hours. That's not bad. And look at this scammer. This scammer had to draw a shoe. Look at how... Like, so other scammers, for comparison, when asked to draw a shoe, have drawn this. Whatever that's supposed to be. <laughs> and, then this, and then this other scammer was going nuts. They were spent like two hours drawing things. They're, they're not, they weren't half that bad. Um, they weren't half that bad. That's not how you say that. Um, but yeah, there's a couple people in there. I also was playing this for you guys. We have um, a new feature, which is that they say song lyrics instead of like Purple Pig and stuff, if you saw the video. So here is 
uh, someone said they, they're new and they just got this recommended. So this won't make a lot of sense unless you watch the YouTube video that I just posted. But um, essentially, we made a website uh, honeypot scammers think that they're getting Bitcoin, but they're not going to get Bitcoin. One of the things they have to do when they're on hold is say ridiculous things like lyrics from All Star now. Okay, wait, for context, the scammer doesn't know that they're saying the lyrics to the song and the song isn't playing while they say it. We just, it'll say something like, to make sure you're still on hold, please say, hey now, you're an all star. So we added the music, but underneath, well, uh, Mysterious added it. We need some more. Anyway, um, so yeah, there's, there's been some other, looks like there's a couple people right now. I don't know if anyone's on hold. Currently, it doesn't look like anyone is on hold. They're just in there, like, drawing and stuff. This guy was in here 16 minutes ago on hold. Don't tell me you're too blind to see. Manu no police you. Uh, what? Friend or a friend that I become. Hey, friend or a friend that I become. Hey, I... Why does he say hey? Does he know that they're song lyrics now? Because he was saying so many of them earlier. Uh, we, we know each other for so long. That's from... Um, we've known... It. For so long, uh, the the Rick Roll song. We've known each other. We, we know each other for so long. We know each other for so long. Hey, we know each other for so long. Hey, geek, hey, cool. You say, wait till you talk. <laughs> but no, that's not. That's not it. Watching the rules and hitting the ground running. <laughs> Fed to the rules that I hit the ground running. Nice. Um. He turned to me after the set. He turned to me after the set. He turned to me after the set. Why do you say it so many times? <laughs> you only have to say it one time. Um. Oh, someone just drew a shoe. Yeah, this doesn't look like a shoe to me. Can I put this on stream? I think I can. Yeah, it just looks like something else to me. Um, <laughs> oh, the internet's ruined me. Uh, yeah, I'll I'll show you a picture of. <laughs> It's it's fine. It's a fine shoe. The one on the bottom, I was just a little concerned about at first. <laughs> Sorry, um, but it looked like maybe I would say like spaceship <laughs> before I would say shoe, like a rocket, <laughs> airplane. Yeah, definitely not. I definitely wouldn't say shoe. <laughs> so to be fair there's a scammer on this fake website that we built right now 
who thinks that they're getting some Bitcoin. Well, they, sorry, to be, to be, I don't know if I made this very clear in the video. They, they are criminal, they are scammers who think that they are, I mean, they're trying to steal this money. Um, like this guy actually, uh, is telling people that they're one of the leaders of the Illuminati, but that you, in order to join, uh, like you're accepted into their to their group um you have to buy a bunch of materials and pay like a membership fee but once you once you do that then you'll be in and you'll get all kinds of power or whatever uh so this guy thinks that he received a 200 the equivalent of like 200 dollars worth of bitcoin um and he has spent 11 hours trying to uh get that uh bitcoin that he's you know stealing from from someone and he's currently drawing shoes to complete his human verification step because he can't get the money out unless he proves he's a human obviously if that gives you some context <laughs> asking them to scam me for a family discount the guy who drew the robot uh, is a fake crypto recovery scammer, like hacker, who tells people that have been scammed that they can recover all of their money for them. For her, for like, uh, usually it's an upfront fee of, of like half the cost or, or a quarter of the cost. So if you got scammed $10,000, they'll charge like 2500 bucks to hack this scammer who scammed you and then they just take your money and obviously can't do anything that's nuts okay the guy still hasn't called back um he's on my computer though maybe i can say hello Or does he not know what to do because I said I closed my Chase account? Was that too much for him? I have two Facebook scammers talking to me. One, I think, was already in the gauntlet. There's the one from yesterday who was really suspicious and they said, I got you, nice try. Um, looks like they went back on last night after the stream. <laughs> So initially they were like, oh, I got you. I know this is fake. Black bear. Small cent. Small center. Happy Hetra. That's them and from last night. Mm, 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 mm. Let's see. Oh, but they messaged me on Facebook because they don't want to. Oh, what a lazy scammer. So here's the context. They messaged me. They were on here for about an hour. They spent 12 minutes on hold. Um, And then they messaged me and said, okay, here's what you need to do next. Call this phone number, give them this pin, and follow the instructions. So they want me to call in now. And this is how some of the victims have gotten basically into this system is because some scammer is like, I'm not wasting my time in here. I'm not, or it doesn't understand what I'm saying. So let me get somebody else uh, to go in here and, and like call this number follow the instructions because in their mind they already entered in the their bitcoin wallet and so once someone goes through the automated system and approves the charge then the scammer is going to get all the money but i have to come up with it. they said I, I told them i don't know how to do bitcoins but i can try calling and they said it's simple and easy just call the number <laughs> you call it i Wanted to start.
And then there's another person says, but yeah, I don't think I'm going to be able to do a call with them. Um, Oh, what about this guy? Never mind. Yeah, I don't know what to do. I guess I could call the number, the 1 800 number again and see if I go to. I want to know. I, I kind of wanted to see what else they were going to do with the. Leave a message after the beep. The chase thing. So much to do. Steve, how may I help you today? Uh, yeah, is this Chase? Yes, ma'am. It's a little hard to hear you. I, I was I was talking to a customer service representative from Chase about my case a few minutes ago and got disconnected. All right, okay. So, uh, can you tell me what exactly happened? Your phone is... And who are you? Your phone is breaking up. Uh, okay, is it better now? Hello? What? Hello? Can you hear me? Hello, is it better now? No, I, I can't tell what you're saying. Hello? Sorry. Uh, hello? Yes, hello, sir. Can you hear me? Is, is it Chase, better? Is hello? Chase... Is this Chase? Yeah, this, this is Chase. This is Chase. I'll try calling. I'll try calling you back because I can't hear what you're saying. Hold on. Okay, is it better now? To, uh, what? Is it better now? Can you hear me? No, I I'm not. My name isn't Jeremy. No. You cannot hear me, hello. Yeah, why is it so bad? I forgot about that. When I called them the first time, I had to get them to call me back. Leave a message after the beep. Oh, that's the wrong number. Oh my god, Taylor Swift's Taylor Swift's chatting with me. <gasps> I didn't even notice. <laughs> um Let's see. Taylor Swift pr official private messaging. Wow. I'm so lucky. <laughs> Announcement. Hello. Hello? Hello? Oh, they're, they're so bad. Right, that's fine. Then. I don't need to spend much of my time. 
Ja, hallo? Hallo? Ja, yes, kan ik me Hallo? Ik was de working on the information. Kan je me horen? Holy smokes. Ja, yeah. is dit uh, de guy van Chase? Ja, yes, sir. Ik ben de senior manager. Oké. Okay. Oké, okay, dat is... Hallo? Uh, thank you for calling me back. I was on the other line trying to talk to Chase as well. Uh, um, okay. You were on the other line? Yeah, hold on. Yeah, never mind. I got the senior manager from Chase to cook on the other line. Never mind, sir. Okay, what Hello? were you able to... There's no damage. What were you able to find out? No, no, I'm asking you, like, are we on the conference? No, I hung up on him. Who needs him? Mm -hmm. um, what okay, were I'm you... just getting a few more updates, sir. I... Just give me a minute, sir, okay? I'm getting the update, just give me a minute. Hello? Hello? Yes, hello, can you hear me, sir? Yeah? yeah? Hello? Yes, did you see from Chase customer support? Uh, you saw our phone, our phone is in the hand. Okay. Can you hear me? Can you hear me now? Sorry, I'm, I'm on the line with someone else right now. I don't know what... I don't know what you're saying. I'm sorry, you got me? Okay, all right, sir. How long, how much longer is it going to take? I, I was thinking maybe I should just go to... Should I call Microsoft? Uh, thank you for. Uh... You there, sir? Yeah, I'm here. Yeah, okay, sir. Uh, we just got the confirmations uh, that uh, since uh, we have found some multiple transactions as well uh, using your chase information, and we need to uh, verify everything is going good and fine, sir. So what I'm going to do, I'm going to connect your line to the Bank of America Fraud Department. You can uh, go ahead and you can let them know to have some extra protection on your Bank of America account. Sir. So please stay connected with me while I go ahead and transfer this line to the Bank of America Fraud Department. Okay? Oh, thank you so much. All right, so welcome. Just stay connected with me. Maybe maybe you were right, chat, about he was setting it up. So for those of you that are new, sorry I've been out kinda of all over the place today, but um he these guys potentially are now going to play a recording of Bank of America or like merge a call with the actual Bank of America phone number. So you'll hear something like, Welcome to Bank of America, blah 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 blah. And then they want you to go through the IVR system a little bit and then when it thinks that they're going to transfer, when they think it's going to transfer you to a person, they just drop the call and have another scammer, like, pick it up and say, like, hi. Your line has been connected okay. to the Bank of America. My name or is Daniel just do this. How can I assist you today? Uh, I'm doing well, Daniel. Thanks for taking my call. Mm -hmm. Yes, sir. Uh, your line has been connected to the Bank of America. I'm the, uh, we are from the fraud department. How can I assist you today, sir? Um, I'm not sure, to, to, to be honest. Um, I was told that there might be something wrong with my account. All right, sure. Uh, what exactly is going on? Can you just see me? Like, why I have, like, we have received the email. From the Microsoft, and can you just let me know what exactly is going on, sir? I don't know what's going. On. Like, is there any, all uh, right, is there any fraud transaction which has been made under your name, sir? Hello. 
I, 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 I honestly don't know. I, I was trying to get to my account, and then, and then I guess there was a virus on my computer. And okay. I'm just trying to make sure that everything's okay with my bank. All right, all right, sir. That is the reason, sir. You know, like uh, we have also received the email from the Microsoft, all right, and like they have uh, put a red flag for this uh, unauthorized transaction, like whatever transaction has been uh, gone through to your account. So that is the reason they have transferred your call to us, all right? So there is nothing to worry about it, all right? Uh, let me go ahead and check, all right? So first of all, uh, before I address your issue, can you just help me out with your first name and the last name, sir? Yeah, this is Ronald Andrews. Ronald Andrews, all right. And uh, can you just help me out with your current uh, zip code, sir? What's your current zip code? Uh, 44138. Sorry, it's 4413? 441. Three eight. Mhm. Mm four four one three eight. And for banking and security purpose, can you just help me out with the last four digits of the social search, just to make sure I'm speaking to the right person or not? Yeah, it's six nine five five six nine. Five, five. All right, sir. Just Thanks. hold the line, sir. Let me pull out your information, and I'll let you know what exactly is going on. Hold the line, sir. Okay. Thank you. All right, so can you again repeat me your zip code, sir? What's your current zip code? 44138. 44138. All right, and your last four digits of the social is 6955. All right. Now, sir, like we have uh, just received the email uh, from the Microsoft, and I can see like there is a unauthorized you know, transaction, which is uh, okay. done by the, you know, like, uh, have you have you ever made any subscription to any of the porn hubs or any sites, sir? Yeah. You have made a subscription? Because, sir, you know, I can see there is two transactions. Oh, wait, what? So uh, their script is to say that yes, sir. somebody I made two like a twenty thousand dollar subscription to Pornhub. So I'm just uh, wait. There's like, two. You, there should only be one. There should, there should only be one. You said there's two. Yes, sir. Because I have the lifetime plan. Which right, one? Is, which now, one do you here, see? Uh, uh, sir, I can just see there is a Pornhub website, sir. You know, I can just see here it's a Pornhub website. You know, I cannot see the exact link, whatever, uh, here. Wait, are you saying right, porn are from the, with a uh, P? Yes. Oh, yes. God, no, no, that's not me. I thought you were talking about corn with a C. No, I'm a cor... I thought you were talking about Cornhub, like the, the gardening super center. Um... No, no, sir. It's a phone hub website. Sir. Oh, it's a yuck, website. Gross. I know you like. No, no, no. That's not you, sir. That's All right, sir. Me. Now, just to make sure, you know, yes, sir. Just to make sure, no amount has been deducted from you. You won't know what to right? do if I don't. Freak uh, at this out. point of time, so like this is an unauthorized transaction. All right, we need to stop this transaction. So first of all, sir, uh, like, uh, what yeah, kind of account be, do you It couldn't be me up? because I, a, I got a discount. Uh, through through silver singles for a different for a different right, resource so I, for a different adult resource. Oh. 
So that wouldn't have been me. I, All right, sir. I, I only uh, do citizen discounts. All right, sir. No problem. So, now, uh, can sorry, you see senior citizen sir, discount. Oh, uh, Okay, sir. Now, just to make sure, you know, sir, no amount has been deducted from your account. Can you just uh, see me, like, what kind of account do you hold with us, sir? Is it a checking account? Is it a saving or a business account? Yeah. Sorry, sir, like you have a checking and a saving? Yeah. And a uh, money market. All right, sir. And money market. All right, no, no worries, sir. Now, sure, just to make sure, sir, no amount has been deducted from your checking. First of all, let's come with the checking account, sir, because you know this uh, the payment it has been gone through your checking account. So I need to put a red flag for that amount. So can you just give me an approximate amount which you hold in your checking account, sir? Ten thousand. Ten thousand. And what about in your savings, sir? Yes, a prox. Approx and what 000. about in your saving? Uh, Thirty thousand, approx. All right, all right. And uh, yeah. what about you in your money market? Me? Yes, sir. I can hear you. Okay, I'm just, I'm just taking, I'm, I'm just getting a little shut eye. You know, I'm over here on the, on the comfy chair. Okay, go ahead. Sorry, sir. No, you're good. You're good. Yes, what? sir. What's the next question? Yes, sir. And what about, and what's, uh, what's, uh, like, what's the amount which, which is in your money market, sir? I think, like, 30000 or so. All right. And is there any credit card which is linked with us? Nah. I don't do credit cards. Those things are a huge scam. Exactly, sir. Now, sure, uh, is there any 401k? Is there any IRA which is linked with the Bank of America, sir? Not with Bank of America, no. All right. Now, apart from Bank of America, is there any bank account which is linked with your social? Uh, not, that, not that I know of. All right. So this is the only bank sure. that you're banking with? I used to bank with Chase. Bank. All right, so this is. I don't bank with All Chase right. anymore. You used to. All right, sir. Now, yeah, no problem, I sir. Now, the reason. You know, I closed the account out because mm -hmm. I, I was nervous about it. My neighbor told me something. All right, sir, no problem. Now, sure, the reason, you know, why I'm asking each and every question to you is. Like apart from Bank Sorry of about America, that. I was in the bathroom. Yes, yeah, sure. No problem. Now, okay, here, I'm going. I'm, going, I'm heading Bank back in the bathroom, though. Keep going. You're fine. Okay. Can you still hear me? Yes, sir. Okay. Thanks so much for your help, by the way. All right. Now, sir, you know, apart from Bank no, of America, you can like we found that, that. Uh, you can cancel that one charge and then. We'll, uh, we'll just handle it from there, right? All right, sir. I do understand, sir. Like, can you uh, let me complete, sir? Let me give you some more information, like what exactly is going on, sir? Are you listening to me, sir? Yeah, I'm listening. All right. Now, sir, apart from Bank of America, like we found, there are three more bank accounts which is linked under your personal information with different bank and financial institutions, you know, such as Wells Fargo, PNC Bank, and Navy Federal Credit Union. So do you, are you banking with this three bank, which is under your name, sir? No. No, I don't do that. Right. So, no. Sir, let me... No, sir, no. Yes, sir. Let me, okay, sir. Let me explain to you, sir. Now, with all these three bank accounts, sir, we found there is a large amount of wire transfer which has been made to various part of country like Mexico and Colombia. Okay. Like, have you ever made any wire transfer recently in the past, sir? No. No. Because, sir. You, because, sir, it is under your name, all right, I can see here, like, there is a large amount of wire transfer which has been made under your name. So, as you are assuming that these are not the bank account which has been opened under your name, 
So it seems that someone is trying to use your identity. You know, this is a matter of identity capture. And here, at this point of time, sir, I have also checked out your past records, your banking contain and general records, and there is no other complaint in the past. That is the reason, sir. You know, what I'm going to do for you is that, sir, as you are saying that this... Sir, are you, are you just reading a news article, bank- or are you saying that somebody wired money from my bank account? I, I'm, I'm sorry. I'm, I'm no, 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 somebody has told your information. It sounded like you were just sir. reading MSN or something. Are you, are you telling me... I kind of zoned out no, there sir, for a minute. No, sir, I'm thinking... Sir, I'm explaining to you like someone is trying to use your information, sir. Someone is trying to use your identity, oh and we God. found there is a large amount of wire, large amount of wire transfer They're which has been made to various part of country. No, ain't no yes, way. Sir. Using your. They're trying to use my identity. God forbid. Yes, sir. God forbid. So that is the reason, sir. Like, uh, yes, sir. Let uh, let me do one thing. You know, How like I have also check out the past for? report, sir. Uh, sir, uh, by uh, it's been a month, sir. What? This like is you, first. This is the first time is the reason, I'm hearing sir. of it. Yes, well, maybe that's the reason, sir. You know, uh, like your uh, information has been hacked. That is the reason, sir, from the Microsoft. I believe, like, maybe your uh, they have a breach into your network, and it has been hacked. You know, they have hacked your information. Oh God! Your Son identity. of a breach. Right. So, all right. So what let a me do Let me send all the. Yeah, let me do one thing, sir. Let me send all the case information to the U.S. Marshal, all right? Of course, you know, they'll be the right person to suggest you out with this case. So just hold the line, sir. Let me send all the case information, okay? Scan the line, sir. It will just take a couple of minutes, all right, um, uh, so that I can send all the information. Thank you. So that I can you. let them know what exactly is going US on. U.S. Right. Marshal, holy. Yeah. <sighs> yes, sir. Scan the line. How long is it going to take? Can I go get a... Is it all right if I go get a drink? Um, okay, I'm gonna, I'm just gonna go get a drink and a snack really quick, because I don't know what he's doing. Uh, I guess he's gonna probably pass the phone to someone else. I'll be really, I'll be really fast, but, uh, I'll be right back. Wait, do I work All right, for sure. Sam's Club? Sure. Yeah, oh, yeah, absolutely correct. Uh, yeah, are you right, still there? Right? Because you were the one who oh. started working with us. Sure, I'm here. So we can, can you hear me? Yeah, can I go, can I get, you just give me two minutes? Yes, sir. I got to get some coffee. I didn't realize it was this serious. All right, sir, no problem. You said I got to talk, time, sir. do I need to talk with the U.S. Marshals? Yes, sir. Okay. Should I should I look their number up on my computer or how do I get in touch with them? All right, no no worries, sir. Let me do one thing. I will directly patch a call, or what you can make them understand that there is some uh, fraud bank account which has been opened under your name. You know, they will definitely help you out. What exactly is under your name, sir? They will definitely help you out to get rid out of the situation. Uh, and like, sir, have you ever have you ever? Like, have you ever, like, does someone have access to your uh, banking account, sir, apart from you? Maybe I don't your think friends, so. your family members? Uh, my ex-wife. And how often do you visit to the bank? And how often do you visit to your bank, sir? Maybe once a month, every couple months. I don't know. 
All right, sir. Uh, let me update this. All right, Bef uh, I'm still sending the information to the U.S. Marshal. All right, so just hold the line, sir. Okay, I'll let be right back. This. I'm gonna go grab some coffee. Okay. All right, sir. Grand Wait, doctor. do I work for Sam's Club? I'm sorry, yes, I forgot. Yes, absolutely correct. Right, right. Because you were the one who oh. started working with us, so we can I'm do this. We have it, you know, Are you my boss? we have a place. Yeah, sure. I'm so sorry that I didn't remember that I worked for you. I hope you can forgive me. And I'll do... No, yeah. I'm going to do such a better job. I'm going to do much better this time. I didn't even know I had a job. Is Mike available? Yes, Martha. I, this is Martha. Yes, yes, this... Hello? Yes, Martha. Are you at uh, Target store? Yeah, yeah, I'm here. Martha, now you need my to listen God. to me very carefully. I'm a little oh. in over my head over okay. here. Uh, okay. Uh, I, are you, I wasn't are expecting you to be the doing all are you this outside? today. So. Oh, yeah, I know. I know. They got me at the cash register. <laughs> do you get work? Yeah, I do work. I do work here. Yes. Well, it's so, it literally says self-checkout, and you've been trying to scan all my items. Uh, do you want to talk to my boss at all? <laughs> yes, actually. No, Martha, yes, no. Yes, I do. <laughs> this woman, you need to take care of her. She doesn't even have a, she doesn't have a Target, like, badge. She's been sitting here in the self-checkout aisle trying to check people out. There's multiple people, multiple people are trying to find a way to handle this and nothing is being done. You need to get someone right now to take care of her, okay? Uh, president yeah. of the United States of America? Yes, I am the president of the United States of America. From now onwards, you will be directly speaking to the White House, okay? You will not be speaking with any Philip because they are the ones stealing your identity and we just got to know, so we are calling you back. Well, it's an honor, Mr. President. America, the yes, beautiful, Martha. open country that's so brave. America, America, Martha, Martha, Martha. lots of things. Martha, are you there? I love you. And the president is grand And our flag Martha, are you so there? green and had so many stripes <laughs> No one else can put stars in it like us Hippocratic Oath is, I pledge allegiance to the oath of the Hippocrates of America and to the insurance company for which we build. One patient under God with privacy and justice for all. Amen. Yeah. Commercials have come out. Uh, hey, hey, you want a tub? Why don't you come on down to Tony's Tub Emporium? We got uh, all kinds of tubs. We got red tubs, blue tubs, uh, tubs with drains, tubs without drains, any kind of, you know, any kind of drain you need. If you if you want us to put two drains in the tub, we can put two drains in the tub, but, uh, you know, the tubs are going fast, so come on down to Tony's Tub Emporium. Thank you. I, Joe Biden, President of the United States, will sponsor you 
and your crow business. Okay, sir, I'm back. Are you still there? You see, crow pro. In a world where there's not enough crows. Crow pro. We got. Sorry it. about that. Information? Yes, sir. Uh, no, no problem. Now, you know, I have already successfully sent an emails to the U.S. Marshal. So what I'm going to do for you is that now as per determined policy of the bank, you know, uh, what I'm going to do, like we are not here to investigate what exactly is going on, sir. So uh, what I'm going to do, I'm going to handle your information. I'm going to handle this line to the U.S. Marshal. All right, they'll be the right person to send you to after this case, okay? So just hold the line, sir. You can have a word with the U.S. Marshal. You can make them understand what exactly is going on, all right? So what you what are you going to say to the U.S. Marshal, sir? Well, I've always been a big fan of the Marshals. Uh, so I had a buddy in high school who, he, he, that's what he wanted to do when he grew up. So I'd, I'd probably say thank you first, and then uh, we'll just get right into the, right in the thick of it. No, no, sir. What are you going to see about the uh, uh, thought, like, transaction, about the fraud bank account which is open under your name? When I'm transferring a call to the U.S. Marshal, what are you going to say to the answer? Uh, uh, hold on. I took notes. Give me a sec. Okay, it was... Uh... Uh, yellow, black, yellow, black, black, yellow. No, sir. Uh, let me do one thing, all right? I will directly uh, uh, patch you... a call to the U.S. Marshal. You can have a word with them, okay? Okay, thanks. Just hold the line, sir. Sure. Yes. I wonder why they always do that. Alright, we'll transfer you and you can explain it again. Like he said the micro the, the one guy said that for for Bank of America and now Thank you for patiently waiting online. Your line has been connected to the Department of US Marshals. Uh, uh, you are speaking uh, with hi. Officer A. Peterson. Hey, this is Ronald Andrews. Thank you for your service, sir. God bless you. You know, I, uh, it's an honor to be speaking with a fire marshal uh, about about my case. You know, my I, mm -hmm. I grew up in a small town, and you know, it was all fire volunteer fire firemen and, and firewomen. And I remember you guys used to do this. You'd do this thing at the elementary school where. You'd have a, you'd give all the kids hats, and you'd bring the fire trucks. And and God, you, I didn't know you guys didn't get paid. I assume you get paid, but um, you know, you used to put fire, you used to put fires out for free. And uh, that's God bless you guys. You know. Um. So. I don't Thank you so much for the compliment, sir. I can see here your line has been connected to the Department of U.S. Marshals from your bank. Yes. So may I know the reason why they go ahead and connected your call to us, sir? Probably because they found out I was burning down. I I, I, I was raking up my leaves, and I, I lit them on fire, so I assume it was against the law. Is that it? The fire, you're the fire marshal, correct? We are speaking with U.S. Marshals, sir, not Fire Marshal. Oh, wait, this isn't an arson-related thing? Uh, okay, is this about the bank charges for the, for the, <laughs> oh, no. He's already done. I can't handle this stuff anymore, man. <laughs> they can't, <laughs> they can't. They just can't listen to for like five seconds. Oh, okay, hold on. I'm just gonna call him back.
I think they're just so convinced that their script must be perfect. Right. Uh, yeah, is this the uh, U- sorry, is this the US Marshal's office? Yes, correct. This is Officer Sam Hoffman talking to you. Sorry, we just got okay, disconnected. I, I thought I was talking to the to the fire department. I, I, are you guys helping me with my case with my Bank of America? Yeah, I'm helping you with the case. First of all, just do one thing. Can you please give me a call back? In the, can I know which officer you're talking to, first of all? This is Ronald Andrews. Okay, Ronald Andrews. Uh-huh. Just being home for a moment, let me have a word with my officers, which we're going to talk to you, and which your case is with, with whom, all right? Okay, because I, I got a serious case going on. Someone was charging money. Yeah, okay, fine. No problem. Just being home but, for a to moment. To be clear, I, I don't want to be transferred to the fire uh, marshals. Not, this, isn't a, this isn't about arson. This is about the charge in my bank account, okay? I understand that, sir. What I'm telling you is this. Just be in hold for a moment. I'll talk to the officer. I would like to know who officer is looking to take care of your case file. Let me transfer the call to that officer, all right? Okay. Thank you. Okay. What's your name again? Ronald. Is Ronald what? Andrews. Okay. Just be in hold for a moment. Okay. These guys seem to have the typical you must listen to me since I'm an officer. Yeah, yeah. Um I just I have fun I enjoy the Alright, let me put you into an absurd situation stuff. Um And and it's hard when they don't, if they're not going to listen or they're not going to, um, like I started off by saying that whole thing about firemen and the fire marshals and the fire trucks, I, I said it like Thanks six times and he just wasn't listening at all. He's like, thank you. Can you hear me? Hello, you there? So I figured. Uh, yeah. Hello. Yeah. Can you hear me? Yeah. Can you hear me? Yeah, I can hear you, sir. Did you? Mm, so, can I know which 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 officer you're talking to? Yeah, I I don't know your name yet. I'm trying to speak with the the U.S. Marshals in regards to my pornography case, pornography charges. Okay, you, you had a few you had talk before with someone else. Yeah, I don't remember his name. Uh, I thought it was a fire marshal, but. Okay. Uh, can so you, you have help a voicemail me? from the U.S. Marshal? Yeah, so yeah, I, I can was, help you. I was you speaking, have a case ID number? I was speaking with Bank of America because there's a charge in my account for a for a, 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 a pornography subscription, and I didn't do it's that okay. charge. I don't want it to be there, and so I found out someone's right. been stealing my identity. Okay. So now, did they, did 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 they provide you a case ID number, sir? Not yet, no. No case ID number. So this is a O one, correct? Uh huh. Is this your one O one two? Yeah. Okay, just be in hold for a moment. Just disconnect this line. I'm making a call back from the officer who's taking care of the case file, all right? Oh, okay. 
Okay. So just receive the call when he calls you back. Okay, so someone's going to call me back? Yeah, somebody's somebody going to call you back from our office. Any officers who will be taking care of the case file, the case file number. With the case file number, the batch ID number of the officer. What's, the, what's my case file? To, this is Officer Sam Hoffman from the Investigation Department of the U.S. Marshal. And you can note down my batch ID number. It's DEAL2925. What the, what in God's name did you just say? No, I'm telling you, you're having a word with this is Officer Sam Hoffman from the Investigation Department of U.S. Marshal. Uh-huh. And U.S. Treasury. Uh-huh. And then you can note down my federal batch ID number. It's DEAL2925. I believe you'll be nearby your phone. I'll just arrange a call back from the officer who's taking care of. Hello? Hello? Yeah, who's this? Hello? Hello? This is from the front department of Bank of, Bank of America, sir. Okay, hold on. <clears throat> um, I was just on with the U.S. Marshal. Uh, why are you calling me? Is everything okay? Oh my gosh, they're the most. I don't. I can't. I can't, man. Did he just mess up? Was he supposed to say that he's the marshal and then said Bank of America? The number you are trying to call has been disconnected. Goodbye. Oh, and now he, and now he, what does he block me because he's so embarrassed or something? They're so... Thank you for calling Bank of America. This side is Ethan Mellers. How can I help you today? Uh, yeah, I'm trying to speak with uh, uh, the U.S. Marshal, uh, Sam. Sam Hoffman. I beg your pardon. You have called the Bank of America, sir. Oh. Uh, I was just speaking with Officer Sam Hoffman. I beg your pardon, sir. Your voice is not audible to me. Can you hear me? Yes, sir. Now can I hear you? I've been breached. You have been breached? Yes. Someone's using my identity. And I okay. want to talk to Officer Sam Hoffman, please. Sam Hoffman? Sam Hoffman, the U.S. Marshal. I just called this number five seconds ago. He told me my case number. He told me his badge number. He told me his badge number. Okay, sir, can you let me know, like, oh, what was the case you're facing? Can you verify me so I can help you further? Yeah, my case number is uh, GGN0. No, no, sir. No, no, sir. I'm not asking your case number. I'm not asking your case number. Just let me know, like, what was the problem you're facing from the very beginning so I can help you. I've been breached. Somebody's using my okay. ac my account and my identity to to purchase pornography. You mean that you have been hacked, right? Yes. You mean to say that you have been hacked? Yes. So you, you have been hacked, so you want to talk to the bank or you want to talk to the technical support? I want to talk to the U.S. Marshals because I need help. The U.S. Marshals because I need help. Okay, just hold the line for a minute, okay? And what is the uh, what is the purpose that you want to talk to the U.S. Marshal? Because someone stole my identity and was wiring money to Mexico. Okay. <clears throat> so, sir, uh, did you call uh, 
you call your bank, sir? Yes, I called you. Oh, yeah. So uh, you want to check me your account and all? No. No, I already know that I I already know that I have a problem with my account. So do you want to fix me your account, sir? Do you want to check me further? Can you fix it? Yes, sir. Because you have called us regarding some problems, right? Yes. Did you talk to the Microsoft or to the Apple support, sir? Microsoft. Hey, they asked me to go get some... Uh, Microsoft. Uh, they asked me to go get some something from an ATM machine. Are you familiar with that? No, sir, I'm not from the ATM machine. I'm, I'm, the, I'm from the bank, sir. I'm from the bank. Okay. Can you help me I'm safeguard my money or so you no? Need, so can you help... If you need any help regarding your bank accounts, your accounts, do let me know. Can you? Yeah. Can you help me safeguard my money? Yeah. Can you help me safeguard? Yes, sir. Of course. So before I go ahead and assist you further, sir, I'm going to ask you some security questions. Are you okay with that? Yeah. Okay. Just hold the line. Okay. Let me check your accounts. This is some cost fallacy. <laughs> Hello, sir. Are you there? Can you hear me? Yeah, it's just I'm involved in sunk cost fallacy. Can you help me? Because I... Yes, sir. First of all, sir, first of all, sir, before I go ahead and make sure that I'm talking to the right person, can you verify me your full name? Yeah, it's sunk cost. Yeah. And my last name is can fallacy. Can you spell it out? Can you spell me out, sir? Yeah, S U N K O S T. Okay. Okay. I said my last name is Fallacy. And what's your last name? F A L L A C Y. L L A C Y, right? L L A C Y. Okay, so can you verify me the date of birth? Yeah, I was <clears> born uh, <throat> April 20th. Okay. 1969. Okay. Can you verify me the last four digit of your social security number, sir? 1337. Okay. And do you hold any credit card or debit card with the Bank of America? Yeah. Okay. Can you tell me the last four digit of your credit card? Two two five five. Okay. And the last four digit of your debit card, sir? Nine 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 four. Okay. And, and do you hold only a checking account or a savings account with us, sir? I got I got them both. You got them both, sir. Okay. Can you verify me the last available balance on your checking account, sir? Yeah. Can you hold on one second? Okay. So not a problem. My grandson just sent me a text of his art project. He had to draw a crow lifting weights. It's much more interesting than this conversation. Sir, uh, sir, uh, you told me at the very beginning that you have been hacked, right? You're you are a victim of identification theft, right? Yes. And identity theft is not a joke. So, sir, uh, did the Microsoft did the Microsoft team? provided you some safety guidelines like yes. do not mention or do not dispute disclose or disclose this case to anyone yep so just follow some safety guidelines okay sir 
and do not use your devices, okay? Do not use all of your devices, okay? Okay. okay. Okay, so can you confirm me the last available balance when you're checking your checking? $100,000. $100,000. Yeah. Can I talk to the marshals or no? So you have called the bank, not the marshals. But I can do one thing, so I can transfer your call to the marshals. But uh, let me do one thing first. Let me help you out regarding this case, okay? Okay. Yeah, it's just I'm standing outside the Bitcoin ATM they told me to go to. That's all. Okay, just hold on a moment, okay? Okay. okay. <clears throat> and not, what's the available balance on your savings, sir? I'm just not sure what to do because they had me withdraw $10,000 and go to this Bitcoin ATM. Okay, sir. Okay, okay. Just hold on a moment. Just hold on a moment. Yeah, I have it. Let me check I have each the, and everything for you, okay, now? I have the 10000 in cash. I Let just need to know what to do next. Okay, sir, I'll guide you what to do. Let me check what's the wrong in your account, sir, okay? Okay. okay. Just have patience. Just be patient with me. I'll, it will take not more than two minutes, okay? Just be on the line. Okay. I actually don't know what I'm, I don't know what I'm doing right now. <laughs> I'm sorry. I'm so, I think I was like, I think I've fallen into some cost fallacy for real. I, I was like, wow, they're running a chase, a, like a new chase scam. This is crazy. Forget the B movie. Let's take this really seriously. And now I don't know what's happening. Um, Man. Sir, I, I think this guy's starting over. For you, sir, okay. Hello. Oh, Are okay. You Can you hear me, sir? Yeah. Sir, I check each and everything for you, sir. And while I was checking for your account, I came across a very suspicious thing on your account. Like that sound very fishy to me. So, <clears throat> what was I it? Tell you, sir. Yeah. Sir, I just went through your account, and as I can see here, <clears throat> there is a charge of ten thousand dollars, ten thousand going towards China for child pornography subscription. Uh huh. And that money has not been taken out from your account, and it has been scheduled to be yeah. taken out from your account Are in you the next two me? hours. Yes, sir. Did you did you hear what I told you? No, no, sir. I so I went to that. the bank and I took out ten thousand dollars cash, and I am standing in yeah. front of a Bitcoin ATM machine. Yes. Yeah. Because the U.S. Marshal told me to take the ten thousand dollars out so I could send it to you guys. Yes, sir. That's that's the same thing I'm explaining you, sir. That's the same thing now, I'm explaining you. I don't need you to explain it. Skip you to the part where I give the money to you. Can you help me with that part? Okay, sir. Okay. Just hold on a moment. I'm transferring this call. Okay. Thank you. Okay. I mean, what's a guy got to do to... I beg your pardon, sir? Nothing. I, I'm just saying, I got to get I gotta get just, done with... Just bear I... with me a moment, sir. Just Thank bear you. with me a moment, okay? I'll guide but, you what to do and I'll transfer this call, okay? Talk about suspicious. Just bear with me a There's moment. some suspicious-looking people over here at this ATM. <laughs> I'm just guiding you one thing, sir. Please do not dispute or disclose this case to anyone. Just hold on a moment. I'm transferring this call to Marshall, and you'll, you. uh, they will guide you how to 
send you that money, okay? Okay. Thank you so much. Uh, this is, this was me trying to find a Bitcoin ATM, but I was too afraid to go inside of the building. <laughs> I was in, I was in Austin and I typed in Bitcoin ATM near me and I just went to it. And then, yeah, sorry, it's a bad photo. Um, and there's like barbed wire all around the building and stuff. <laughs> and I'm like, I don't know. Hello, sir. Are you there? I don't know if I'm going in there. Hello, can you hear me? Yeah, yeah. Sir, do you have a car with you? Yes, I do. Yes, I do. Just go and uh, just go and sit down inside your car, sir, for a moment of time. Just relax, okay? Okay, but I'm. I, the U.S. I, market I, will be in a minute, okay? Just but I started have, just, putting my money in this just ATM. Have a in your car. I, I just. I, I can't leave because I already started putting money in the machine. Okay, okay, sir. Okay, okay, okay. And there's other people waiting to use it too, so we kind of got to hurry. Okay, sir. Okay, just hold on. It's it wants me to enter a wallet, or there I have a choice not to. Uh, there's another option that says. I don't have a wallet. I would like to move it to a a third party holding wallet so I could share it at any time. But I forgot you're not listening. So <laughs> Those pictures are so stupid. <laughs> I think I think I told you the story. So the one, the one here, is like in a hotel, and there's people everywhere, and my, um, my 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 buddy has a. Uh, like a like a his phone out and he's like okay you gotta record like a like a youtube intro because you know someday you're gonna need this footage and i i just i'm like there's no way i'm gonna what's up you guys it's me kiboga i'm i'm here at the bitcoin atm <laughs> and there's people there's people everywhere like there's no way it's your boy Kipoga back with another banger of a video in front of a Bitcoin ATM machine. So that was the best that was the best I could do was take an awkward picture. <laughs> you look like a dad? I'm, well, I am a dad. What's up, gamers? <laughs> uh, obliterate that subscribe button. So, um, what's the guy got to do to get scammed by by these guys? <laughs> Someone just drew a large, properly formatted data file in the gauntlet. Let me show you. It's kind of...
that one one moment sorry uh Oops, I'm on the wrong scene, but that's okay. They just drew this. There's a large properly formatted data file. <laughs> and then it <laughs> and then they failed the verification process. <laughs> uh. How do they, how do you win the ver verification process? I want to see if anyone's on hold right now. Ah, uh, no. I hear the drums. Can you please call? Yo, thanks. Um, for the hype chat, can you please call Abel back? It's been too long. <laughs> I no, I I I don't have Abel's personal phone number. He he disappeared after after we were through with him. Wait, so, oh my gosh, so after they complete the, <laughs> after they do all the drawings, it's just a 40% chance? I didn't know that. It's literally math.random less than 0 0.4. <laughs> so after they do all the drawings, they just... It just might, they might have to do them again. Oh, okay, so that's why. We, we've had a lot of drawings from some people. They're honestly getting really good. It's kind of surprising. Hold on. Like the snake wearing a hat? This robot? A crow lifting weights? <laughs> I think I showed some of you guys this one earlier. Look at this castle. Oh my goodness. A banana. I still think by far, like, if I had to pick one that I've seen so far, that to me just... This is nuts to me. That shoe. I don't know why, but something about... Just the time they took to, there's something about that shoe to me. And they drew so many shoes. Maybe that's part of it. Like they alternated the style of shoes <laughs> each time. But, like, look, these are three different drawings that the same scammer made. Um, like they were really trying. <laughs> needs a Nike logo Nike they actually did uh, they did a shoe that has a swoosh on it I'm not joking I don't know if I could find it but 100% somebody did that it was the same it was the same scammer um here I found it
<laughs> right? Like, that must be the logo. Um, and then if we ever make, if there's ever like somehow, I think I've accomplished, like, when I was younger, I had, okay, now I, I, got, I can't tell this story without getting emotional. So anyway, look at this guy. That's, I think that's supposed to be a crow lifting weights. It looks like he should be in a video game. That should be like. That's the crow, I, I guess. Like, I don't want to make fun of them too much, but oh, you know what I just realized? Okay, something else. We're still on hold, by the way. I don't know why. Uh, sure, are you there? I'm... Yes, sir, I'm there. Can you hear me? Yeah, what do I do with this? What am I supposed to do with this thing? Just it's hold telling... on a moment, sir. I just talked to the U.S. Marshal. They are, they are currently busy. They will be in a moment. Just yeah, hold so on for two or three minutes, okay? I just, Not there's more a than button that. called Easy Send. It says if you don't have a Bitcoin wallet, you can select this to send the money to anybody conveniently. Can you withdraw that money so can you? If so I just pressed I just pressed the easy send option. Uh, it gave me a code. Do you want the code? Okay, sir. Listen to me. Which making model of the cell phone are you using, sir? Yeah, it's called a um it's called a Nunya. Namia? Yeah, Nanya. What's the making company? Business? What's the making company of your cell phone? Oh, it's Jitterbug. Okay, I'm sending you in this number the barcode of the wallet, okay? Okay, well, I selected the... I, I, okay, you can send it to me. Is it a periphery reference? Is there a periphery reference to to Nanya? Do I not know about that? I'm not a true fanboy. What is the periphery reference? Okay, well, I sent you an Instagram scammer selling microchip deactivations. Wait, what? That's interesting. Uh, I don't know what that is, but yeah, did you do the exclamation point submit? Hello? Can you hear me you there? Hello? Uh, yeah, I can hear you. So can you please provide me your email address? Yeah, why? Can you not... You can't text me? I need to send you the barcode. The Bitcoin wallet. Okay, it's... Are you ready for it? It's Richard... Are you ready for it? Yeah, I'm ready for it. It's R I C H A R D. Yep. Andrews. A N D R E W S. Okay. Okay. And, and then. Okay, I'm sending you the bean hole. Okay. 
I haven't logged in here for a while. Let's okay. see what kind of surprises are waiting. Mm -hmm. Just being all I'm sending you the wallet. Okay. I've got mail. Uh, I don't have any mail from you yet, though. I have a couple people saying that they're going to help me with investments. Um, Did you send me an email yet? I mean, I guess this is, all things considered, I guess this is encouraging. I'm, I'm a little bit like, man, you got to be kidding me. Just be in hold for a moment, sir. I'm sending because, you. But like, he, they are so well, ill prepared, you know, to like handle this scam. I, I thought like, God, they, they planned all this out. They have some domain that is like a misspelling of Chase. They got this virus pop up with Chase. They're going to be like this most, this will be the most professional scam in the world. And now the guy can't even, like, I'm, I'm begging, I'm like practically begging him to scam me and he can't scam me. <laughs> so I guess that's encouraging in the sense that they're probably not going to be scamming too many people, which is good. You don't want people to get scammed, but, um, yeah, I'm. I'm just sort of like, okay. I've been on uh, two. I just spent two hours with these guys, though. I could. I could have been. Uh, could have been getting people in the car. Could have been, right? Hello. Uh, yeah. Hello. You there, sir? I'm, Can I you hear sure me, sir? I, Mr. Sure Richard, I just sent you the email. I just sent you the email. Did you, did you check your email? Uh, let me let me check. Um, Check your email. I just sent you the uh, Bitcoin wallet, okay? Is it the first time you've ever sent an email? I beg your pardon? Was that the first time you've ever sent an email? No. Okay. This is the first. Is your last name... How do you spell your last name? My name is Rob, sir. Yeah, what's your last name? My last name is Miller. Rob Miller. Okay. Did you receive the Bitcoin wallet now? It says address. There's a giant image. Yes, you need to scan that QR code on the Bitcoin machine, and you need oh, to okay. insert so the cash. I select. I already. I selected the option that said. Um, I don't have a wallet. I would like to hold my funds with Easy Send, so I can send it to anybody quickly and securely. Here, let me send you a picture. Okay. But you have to put your good listening ears on, okay? Okay, sir. So I selected the option, I don't have a wallet, and it said that my $10,000 is, is being held in a secure third-party escrow system, and that anybody with the code can manage my funds. On the receipt, it says, don't share this with anybody who you don't trust. 
So, sir, can you do one thing? Like, can you cancel the whole process and start it from the beginning? Nope. There's no option in the machine? No, I already did the whole thing, so... I got a receipt. I got a receipt and everything. Yeah, just, you got the receipt? Yeah. I told you. Okay, click the picture of the receipt and send it to the same mail. Do you listen to anything that I say? <laughs> yeah, you told that you got the receipt, right? <laughs> Holy smokes. Yeah, let me send this to you. Yeah, let me send this to you. Yeah, please, please, sir. And then I'll probably be on my way. Um, I pushed, I had a, I, mean, I had a, yeah, I had a meeting. You know, I, I postponed a meeting, a pretty important meeting for this, you know. Meeting for this. Okay, okay. Can you send the QR code? Sorry, can you send yeah, the receipt? I'm sending it to you now. Did you send it the receipt in the email? Yes. Yes, I just did, sir. I didn't receive any mail, sir. Well, you have to wait at least half a second, okay? I know this is your first time using email. Okay, sir. <laughs> All right. Oh, my God. Um, yeah, so I, I sent you the receipt picture as well as the email that I got. And can you let the U.S. Marshal okay, know? Thank you. Mm -hmm. And that should be 10,000. 10,000, okay? 10,000, okay? Okay. I need, I need to keep it safe. <laughs> yeah, you need to keep it safe, sir. Yes. Sorry. Just be in hold for a moment. I'll talk to the U.S. Treasury. <sighs> okay. I'm just going to try to send those guys at the gauntlet, but I don't even know if they're going to understand. I mean, I just laid it all out for them. I have this whole paragraph. It says, thank you for using blank on your recent purchase of 0.289568 BTC. Our award-winning automated system makes it easy for anyone to send Bitcoin without a wallet. Simply share this unique link with anyone, and they can claim and manage these funds with their own info. And then there's this warning. Do not share this with anyone you do not trust or something like that. Uh, and then there's a link directly to the gauntlet with their code. Um, I mean, I'll, literally all they got to do is click it, and, and they're good to go. Uh, but most of the time, they don't pay attention it's like really hard sometimes it the scammers just don't listen because it's not the thing that they're used to it's not a part of their script so it can be difficult for them but we'll see um I'll see if he clicks the link, but he's he hasn't clicked, so. Uh, what is the gauntlet? Uh, watch my okay, newest YouTube sir, video. Okay, now, sir. Hello. Uh, I'm outside of Wendy's right now. Where where are you? Okay. Where are you? You're inside a car? No, I'm outside of Wendy's. Have you heard of Wendy's before? Yeah, I heard. 
I, I bet. So, uh, Let me sit inside his car and talk to me too. Okay, yeah, I'm gonna go. I'm gonna go get some food, okay? And then after this, I have a doctor's appointment. Did you safeguard my funds? No problem. So just connect this line. The li keep the line open. You can you go in by the Starbucks you're gonna buy, it, right? Okay, but I'm just. I want to know. Did you? Did we cancel that porn transaction since I sent you the ten thousand Bitcoin? I'll let you know everything, sir. You go. Sir, we are on the process. I'll let you know everything. You just go in. You just go and buy your stuff. Come back inside your car and talk to me. Did no you problem. get my? Did we you get the email your, I sent you? Uh, yeah, I got the email. Did you? Okay, because I also I also attached the email they sent me. The email they sent me. You also send the email. Well, they sent me an email okay, and said no thank problem. you for using. Award-winning system. Blah, 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 blah. I got it. Yeah, I got it. Sir. Okay. Thank you. Okay. Do not disconnect the line. Keep the line open. Go and get your stuff. Come back to car and talk. <laughs> okay, I disconnected it. They can figure it out by themselves. Maybe they can figure it out by themselves. Yeah. yeah. So I told you not to disconnect the line. Keep the line open. Yeah, I'll di okay, I'll disconnect. Okay, I can keep it disconnected. No, sir, That's fine. You this <laughs> Bro, I'm not talking to you anymore. Do your... Announcement. Waste your own time, man. Announcement. 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 I got other scammers to to talk to. I got fake Elon Musk talking to me. I got an investment scammer. The mar the U.S. Marshal, yeah, told me not to use my devices because they're hacked. Uh, yeah, this is Ronald. Hello, sir. I told you not to disconnect the line. Just stay on the line, okay? Yeah, the, you can go and buy your stuff. The U.S. Marshals you can told me that food. my phone lines could be hacked, so I shouldn't use my phone. Sir, um, I know so. that your phone lines are hacked, but you are not okay. connected to the secure line. You are connected to the secure line. You can go ahead and buy your food. You can buy your stuff. Hey, I'm, but stay on the line because email, I need to update you simply, and everything, okay? The email says simply share this link with anyone and they can claim it. Should I claim it or are you going to claim it? Sir... Your network, your phone lines are currently secure now, okay? You Shut don't up need and to listen worry to me. anything about it. In the email, it says, thank you for your recent purchase of 0 0.289568 Bitcoin. Share this link with anyone so they can claim it. Should I click the link to claim it, or are you going to click the link to claim it? I will click it, sir. I will click it. Okay, so I shouldn't. I, I won't click it then if you're going to do it. Oh, no. Oh, no. Man, maybe I shouldn't have said shut up. Because now he hung up. <laughs> oh, I might have made him too mad. I'm getting too, I'm getting too impatient. <laughs> I hurt his feelings. <laughs> so one of the things that happens... I wonder if we should do this. One of the things that happens is they're expecting they take out their like um their their wallet application on their phone and they scan the QR code expecting it to be uh, like a what public key or private key or whatever for the transaction. And so sometimes they just sit there and they're like scanning it and it doesn't do anything because well it takes you to a website and they're not they're not bothering to read they don't read the receipt. They don't read the email. They don't. They're just like, why the fuck isn't this working? <laughs> and so he, you could tell there was another scammer with him. They're probably like trying to scan it. <sighs> Hello. Hello. Yes. Yeah, uh, sorry, I just 
I got disconnected with um, I got disconnected with one of the Bank Sir, of America. Are you trying to play with me? Are you trying to play with me? Sorry, who is this? You send me a receipt of date eleven. Sir. Eleven zero one twenty twenty three. That's today's date. Today's date. Yes, two thousand twenty three. Eleven zero one two thousand twenty three. That's today's date, sir. Are you trying to play with me? Okay, I'm so sorry for the confusion, sir. I just check it right now. Everything is good to go now. Today's date is. It's November. It's, yes, it's the yes. first of November. Date, but the format, but the date format was a little bit slight changes on the date format. That was that's why I was a little bit confused. So I'm really sorry for my for my rude behavior. Okay, I'm really sorry. I do apologize from thank, the bottom of my heart. Thank you. I, apology accepted. Okay, sir. So you can do one thing, sir. Now you can just go ahead and have your food and buy your stuff. And keep the line connected. Stay on the line because I need to update you each and everything, okay? Okay. Okay, so thank you so much for your cooperation, sir. Yeah, thank you. Um, I really appreciate your help today. Okay, or, sir. I, we after are here my, to help you, sir. After my doctor's appointment, because uh, I, I got to... Should I call you back in, in, in a couple hours or... or Am I safe? Am I good to go now? You can do one thing. You can do one thing. Uh, you are about to have your food, right? You need to buy some stuff and have your food. Yeah, I gotta go. And uh, and after that, you have a doctor's appointment, right? Yes, sir. Yes, sir. How much time it will take sir, for your doctor's appointment? Two hours. Okay, so. And now you're going to have your food and you need to buy some stuff and have your food, right? Yep. But I, so till then, sir, till you have your food and buy your stuff, you can put me on the line. We is, can be connected. We can stay connected. Okay. Well, hopefully everything's safe. Stay connected um, with me, okay? Yeah. And I'll call, I'll call now, you okay? back in everything a little while, safe. okay? Okay, so not a problem. If I need anything, I'll call you back, okay? Do answer my call. Okay, I'm going to add you in my phone. What was your name, officer? You, you, um, officer. My name is Rob Miller, sir. Rob Miller. Rob Miller. I had, I had a dog named Miller once. Oh. Good dog. Okay. Okay. And, and remember, sir, some of the safety guidelines you need to follow that do not dispute or disclose or mention this case to anyone, okay, till the time everything is not fit. Okay. All right. Just keep it confidential, okay? Could I send the... Okay, and should I... if I need you at any moment, if I need you at any moment, I'll call you back, okay, sir? And do answer my call. Okay, and just text me if you need me to okay. claim the oh. funds, okay? Okay, sir, okay. Have... Okay, so now you can have your dinner or you can have your lunch now, okay? You can oh. have your food. Okay, you thank relax. you so much, officer. I appreciate your help today. Okay, God's, thank God you. bless thank you. you. God bless you. We are here to help you, sir. We are here to help you. Thank and you. I appreciate your cooperation as well. Okay. You're most welcome. Okay. Okay. Oh, my goodness. <laughs> I, just, I didn't even understand what he was when he was like, are you messing with me? I thought it was because I said shut up. But it's because the date format. <laughs> I was like... I mean, I was being a little bit ridiculous. No, it's because he's being like, "Oh, look right here. The dates, the dates wrong. It's the, it's the wrong date format. This guy's totally messing with you. He's, he's just messing with us, bro. This guy's been playing with us the whole time." <laughs> American date format's weird. I will say this: I think a lot of the things that we do here in the U.S. are weird. Um, I don't understand how we do measurements and distances and like you guys got a lot of stuff going on correctly outside of the U.S. But I don't understand the date system. Um, why would you say why why wouldn't you? I don't know. I, I the date 
yeah, the date thing seems fine here in the U.S. All right, it seems pretty good. I could take. I would be fine with the metric system. I'd be fine with all the other stuff you guys do. <laughs> I just, but I don't get the date system. <laughs> just tell me the what is it the 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 timestamps the what the e, the epoch the number of what is it seconds since <laughs> the Linux <laughs> yeah just give me timestamps that's easier um SNL had a good skit about it was it the old SNL because listen no shame. I know there's some cool people who work on that show, but it's just not as good as it used to be. Uh, so if it's like a new skit, I don't know if I'd watch it. But I should. I said no shame. I meant to say no shade. <laughs> but. Also, I told him my name was sunk cost fallacy. Correct. Like I spelled that out. I told I spelled sunk cost fallacy, <laughs> and then he thinks I'm messing with him because the date format's wrong. Well, have you ever met anyone named sunk cost fallacy? <laughs> I didn't even I didn't even think of that part. Ugh. All right. I do have a I actually I do have an appointment. I'm an hour late for. So thanks guys. <laughs> that that's part of thanks for hanging out today. I'll be back tomorrow. Maybe we'll do uh maybe we'll talk to <laughs> this guy still hasn't gone in the gauntlet, probably because he can't figure out how. He he just can't read the like directions that very specifically say how. Um but that's that's fine. It's it's a skill issue. Um, but yeah, we'll be back tomorrow. We'll have some fun. And uh I appreciate you guys. And the wise words of Bob Ross, happy painting, God bless his best for says, Don't be afraid to take chances, make mistakes, and get messy. Know that you're valuable, that you matter. I hope you have a chance to pursue something that you find. Saying it quick seems like it's fake. I I do think you guys matter, and I do think you're valuable. And I do hope that you have some time to pursue something that you're passionate about this week. Um but yeah. <laughs> I'm trying to say it quick, but thank you guys. If you haven't watched the video, go check it out. Um, I think there's some stuff on more Kit Boga as well. I will talk to you guys soon. Bye. Let the rule and hit the ground running. It doesn't make sense for us to live with fun. So much to do, so much to see. But what's wrong with taking the back seat? You never know if you don't go. Hey now, we are all fans. Hey now, we are all fans. Get to show on, get to set. Only you. Ah, uh, let's get the rule and hit the ground running. It doesn't make sense for us to live with fun. So much to do, so much to see. But what's wrong with taking the back seat? You never know if you don't go. Hey now, we are all fans. Hey now, we are all fans. Get the show on. Get it. Only you are ready to get more.